think I'm live. This is different. This is different. Hmm. So this doesn't run it from my YouTube. I hope it's monetized though. So welcome guys. Welcome. I'm trying something new. I'm trying to go live for the Ortiz Martin fight. Uh, I'm trying to go live for the fight through Streamlabs. So this is really just a test today. I am going to complete. I am going to be live for the whole thing. So, you know, the chat should pop up. All types of things should pop up. Once we get some viewers and stuff like that in here, I don't even know if it's even being seen on YouTube. I'm really just testing it out right now. Uh, Washington is fighting, but I just want to say I am live with Streamlabs today, and we're just trying things out to see, you know, what's the end result. If I'm going to move forward with Streamlabs, since it has some cool things like widgets and uh, memberships, and you guys can actually, you know, uh, oh wow, it looks like we got five people in here. So if you comment, it should pop up on my screen. I think I know I'm supposed to add like the chat box. So I don't know if that even works, but let me say hello to the people. This is a little bit sign in the chat. All messages will appear publicly. Why can't I? So I'm not even signed in. Yeah, so this is this is weird. I've never done this before. Hello, people. Oh, the guy beat Washington. The guy beat Washington. So it says I'm chatting, but it's it's making me chat through. It's weird. It's making me chat through the website. I've never used Streamlabs before, but I figured I'd try it out. Oh, okay. So if I chat through there, it, it brings up the chat. But I don't, again, I don't see the chat on my screen. Where is the chat box? Oh, there's the chat box. Duh, Carl, you got to bring it above this. So this needs... Hey, what's up, Flash Custom Design? Okay, so I see you. So this needs to be all the way down here. Chat box. I still don't see the chat box. That's weird. I don't know. It's supposed to be right here. But I don't see it. It looks like that there's five people in here. Also, I don't see... So you found my video, babe? Yeah. Hmm. Uploaded two new videos two minutes ago, mm -hmm. and then I clicked in and it took me to your live event. Mm. I don't know. So I need to. It says I'm live, but monetization is off. Let me turn that on. So you have to turn it on manually. Live now, no restrictions. You got five people in here, so it's weird. Let me see if I play myself. Yeah, this is me. Public. Yeah, so this is me. I am live. It's only showing five people in here right now, but I don't know why my chat box isn't showing up. Let me see if I can find myself. Using this live, because I might go back to regular. I can't even find myself. Yeah, I might go back to regular OBS. Oh, there I am. Let's see how I sound. Yeah, I'm here. Yo. I'm here. It's a little delayed. Yeah, I might go back to regular OBS. Oh, there I am. Yeah, I'm here. Yo. Yo. <laughs> Let's see, because I come in here, but I, I wanted it to pop up. Yeah, yeah, you can put it right here on the chair. Everything is delayed. Okay, there it is. Ooh, got the delicious food. Delicious food. I'll take a drink of ice. Oh, there goes Danny Garcia. Danny Garcia is there. Danny Garcia is there. Yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna. I don't know if I'm a fan of this. I'm gonna have to definitely work on it with video. There are four people in here. Feels like there should be a lot more people in here. Um, but yeah, the thing that I can't see the most, cause I know if there's like a subscriber or something like that, 
But uh, yeah, I guess I I like being able to see it on my screen. I guess I still can theoretically watch myself. But it's weird because you have to turn on monetization after. Oh, we got soda. Oh, you're a real one. So, yeah, I can't watch the analytics of it. Huh. But, yes, that is me right there. And then we've got five people watching, two likes. So we are here. We are here. Canelo Alvarez is there. There's a lot of people there for this fight. I didn't think there's going to be that many people. But people love heavyweights, and tonight's going to be a major heavyweight. You got actors taking pictures with Canelo. Canelo's always in some com comfortable stuff. I still think Canelo's pound for pound. I know people don't like him, but I still think I got Canelo pound for pound. But Yeah, we are here. We are here, guys. We are here. Um, I think... Like I said, I want to test. I'm testing out OBS. I mean, I'm testing out Streamlabs. So I'm not using OBS today, guys. I'm using Streamlabs. Uh, it's got some cool things like super chats and memberships and donations. But the biggest thing that I'm looking for, I don't know why my chat box isn't working. I don't know. I guess I have to figure that out later. I do have time to figure it out now. You know what? Yeah, let me try to figure it out now. If anybody knows how to make a chat box work in Streamlabs, please let me know. We are, but yeah, I get to watch myself over here. I got the fight going right here. Um, Gerald Rossington just lost. He just got stopped. Um, my wife's got shorts on after I told her to not have shorts on. So. <laughs> you can move on that stuff, my baby. I'm sorry. It's all jacked up. So we got some people going up. We got 10 viewers. We got 10 viewers. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. Somebody hit the subscribe button so that I can see if that works. So we got Jonathan Rice versus Michael Coffey, C-O-F-F-I-E. Um, we got them next, the heavyweights. I like that they, they're starting off the year pretty strong. Again, we're starting off the year pretty strong. Shredded the content here. We are starting off the year with some cool heavyweight boxing, all heavyweight fights. So, you know, it's just an action-packed night. Um, it doesn't even matter who's fighting. It's just cool to see heavyweights on TV. But I'm really excited to see uh, King Kong, Luis Ortiz make his comeback. It's pretty cool. Babe. He, him and I have the same birthday. I just found that out today. Yeah, March 29th. He's 1979, but, yep, March 29th. Yep. Huh? Oh, the guy, the main guy who's fighting tonight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's like 42, but I could definitely hear myself. I think I'm going to play some music, guys. I think I'm going to play a little bit of music. I know I turned down my music. Let me know if you guys like my music. Ooh, bless you. Let me know if that's too loud with the music. As we vibe out. Let me know if that's too loud, Mama. Oh. I don't know if you're busy or you were doing something. You, 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 you got mogis? I just sneezed. Oh, you just sneezed? So, yeah, I want to see what's going to happen. I don't Like I said, I don't know why my chat isn't... Can you hear it? Oh. I don't know why my chat box isn't showing up. I got it right there. I don't know why it's not showing up. This guy's last six wins by way of knockout. Johnny Rice, I don't know who he is. Looks like a pretty big guy, though. It's not bad. Michael Coffey, 6'5", 83-inch reach, age 31, 12-1. Fighting out of Brooklyn. Okay, what's up? DK in the building. Yeah, so um, let me know who you guys want tonight. I don't know. Like I said, really, I'm just testing this stuff out. I figured tonight was a perfect night to test out Streamlabs and figure out everything I need to figure out so that I can, you know, up my quality. Um, I guess I can try the. Let me go to my Streamlabs. Yeah, that doesn't take me away. So it still records. Alert box. Okay, they got the new alert boxes. Themes, App Store, and then Grow. Dash oh dashboard. That's the thing I need to go to. Dashboard. So this live streaming can go off. This Canva and stuff like this can go off. And I'm still on here. Canelo. They just keep showing Canelo. 
everybody's swarming around Canelo. So, oh wow, it shows my, it shows my subscribers. Dang, it shows every video. Weird, it knows everything. Okay, here we go. All widgets. Chat box. Do I need a new widget? Copy to show widget URL. Widget URL contains sensitive information. Clean, da, da, da. it's saved. Save settings. Should I just show it? Let me see, launch. I don't know, is it showing it yet? No, it's still not showing it. We got 15 people watching. I don't know how did we got that, but appreciate it. All 15 people watching, guys. We are here for the job. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna give you guys play by play of what's going on um, of the fight. You can just bear with me as I deal with trying to just get some things working because I'm working with Streamlabs. But if you know how to use Streamlabs, please let me know. New Year widget. Okay, New Year widget. What's this? Is it free? Yeah, so I'm really trying, I'm trying to get everybody's chats up, even though nobody's even chatting. I'm still just trying to get the chat box up as we enter this fight. But once the fight starts, um, then I'll give you guys the play-by-play. -play. How do I do this? Copy this. Oh, that's right. That's right. So I got to go here. And chat box. Oh, they're talking to Canelo. I wish I could hear it, guys. I wish I could hear it. Then I can tell you guys what they're saying to Canelo, what he's going to do next, since he's going to light heavyweight to fight somebody. So then the chat box, I think I need to put the link in here. Isn't that correct? Source. Use custom frame rate. Control audio. Refresh browser. Chatter. Font settings, visual settings. Clean. And then HTML. I don't know how to do it. Mm -hmm. It's weird that it's not showing it. I don't know. I guess I have to do some more research on how to get your chat box to pop up. Because I know you have to do something with the. Uh... Oh, what happened to our bank account? What what happened? Um Oh okay, okay, okay. What's that? This one? Oh. Mm. Oh, you're just now doing dang. We we got lucky though, right? It's not midnight. Oh, okay, I didn't know that. I forgot how you do the chat box thing because I really want it on my screen filters properties is it properties uh -uh. please somebody let me know if you know how to do the uh, stream labs stream labs chat box but yeah guys we're here how was your New Year's guys Everybody who's watching, how was your New Year's? Usually people are already commenting. It's weird. 50 people. How was your New Year's, guys? How was... Oh, they got Evander Holyfield? There's a lot of people there. Oh, I need some soy sauce. Um, we got a ton of people in the building today to watch all these heavyweight fights. I didn't see the Paul brothers or anything, but it's cool. It's cool to see that people are actually supporting boxing. Even if it's not major guys, people seem to like Luis Ortiz. Uh, it's cool to see his comeback. I don't want to see him versus Deontay Wilder again, but it might be cool to see him maybe versus uh, Andy Ruiz. Maybe he gets an Anthony Joshua shot if Anthony Joshua loses. Who knows? Right now, the heavyweight division is really packed. Oh, here we go. Oh, we can see the chat box. How? 
But I'm looking at my I'm looking at my live right now to the left. I can't see it. Oh, there it is. It's at the bottom. Oh, that's dope. You got a comment and it comes right at the little bottom. I'm going to make it mad big. Oh, maybe that's right there. And it's like see-through. So whenever it, it'll just run up the side. Like, see, right there, right there, right there. That's you right there on the bottom right. Mama, look right here. It'll pop up right there, watch. Cause I just seen it. You gotta come over here, mom. It yeah. wouldn't be on my screen? It will. You'll see it on the bottom right. Oh, there You seen it? Yeah. <laughs> hey, we in here. We in here. 19 views. Let's go. Now we're about to turn up. We got the we got the street now. See, I was getting skeptical about Streamlabs, but now I'm lit. Now it's lit. I got the music playing. How's the music sound? Can you hear it? It's still good? Should I turn it up a little bit? No, don't turn it up a little bit. Leave it right there. Everything's good, everything's good. We got y'all, okay, the guys are in the ring. The guys are in the ring. Not the main event, guys, not the main event, but the people are in the ring. Thank you, Dez, I appreciate it, Dez, man. You really just saved my life, because that's all I was really worried about was, I want, are you streaming the fight? Uh, what I do, I don't know if you know or not, um, Mr. Dez, but I don't stream the fight. Like, I don't show you guys the fight. I do fight parties and stuff like that and tell you guys play by play the each punch and stuff like that. So, that's what I do. That's how I got my name out here. That's what I do. Um, I need some soy sauce. This shit is blizzing. Daddy's going to get him some soy sauce. Let me long time. Let me long time soy sauce. <laughs> I gotta stream. I gotta entertain the people. It's 2022. Deuces all year. Deuces, deuces, deuces. 2022. 2022. Let's turn it. Let me go get some soy sauce. Y'all got some so if y'all got some soy sauce, go ahead and send it over. Also, we got cool super chat things. So we got cool super chat noises and subscriber noises and uh, donation noises. So it's pretty cool. This I think I can test it. So this is what happens for a new subscriber. Right there. Right there. Um, and then this is what happens for Super Chat. Right there. Right there. You guys like that? Come on, come on, come on. I'm looking, I'm looking better. Your comments are showing up on the screen. You know what I mean? It's pretty cool. You seen it, Mama? Oh, it'll pop up because I think it's delayed. Oh, yeah. Hey, how are you getting hit up on the feet? No. <laughs> don't embarrass me. Getting hit up on the feet? I'm really gonna need a towel. Why did you get one? I don't know, because I couldn't find one. 23 people in there. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. We got the music playing. We eating Chinese food. We got the soy sauce. We got the soy sauce. All right, guys. The guys haven't even started fighting. I don't know who these guys are. I'm going to chill out. 
what happened? Oh, I'm off screen. I'm gonna chill out for a second, guys. Eat my Chinese food while we, uh, yo, these joints is mad good. I'm not sponsored or nothing, but these, these right here are delicious. Delicious. Okay, so, oh, 28 people watching, 28 people watching. I need you guys to smash that subscribe button. Guys, 28 people watching, smash that subscribe button, and you're gonna see this whenever you subscribe. You're gonna see that. Isn't that dope? You'll see your name on screen whenever you subscribe, guys. So 20 subscribers, guys. 20 people watching, guys. Can you guys please hit that subscribe button while I give you guys the play-by-play -play of the fight? So, Rice versus Coffee. Rice is in the white shorts. First round, two minutes to 31 seconds left. Uh, Coffee is in the black and silver shorts. Rice is really hitting him with a really nice jab. How do I see the fight? Uh, you see the fight? You got to order the pay-per-view, kid. You got to order the pay-per-view, or you can hear your boy straight at the content. Give you the live play-by-play. -play. Give you the live play-by-play. -play. Oh, big right hand by Rice. Big right hand by Rice. These two, there's no way, again, it's, they're doing this fight. They're doing all these heavyweights because, you know, with heavyweights, you get knockouts. So, this guy, Rice, is pretty big. I think they're both 6'5", 6'6", 230-plus pounds. Right now, they're really moving really slow, though. Nothing's really happening. The guy, Coffee, isn't punching at all. He's just has his hands up. It doesn't look like he has much experience. None of these guys look like future champions. So Coffee's trying to power shot his way in. But Rice is keeping him back with the jab. But Rice isn't even pressing the action. He's just fainting with the jab and just Punching with the jab, really, that's it. Coffee's trying to counter him and come over top with a left hook. Can you show the fight on stream? No. That's illegal. Sorry, kid, we can't show the fight on stream. This is it, y'all. This is going to be dope. Oh, mommy, you can come over here and watch it if you want. The main event. You can pull your chair up so you can watch it. I'll put it on full screen. You know what I mean? They're still in you. Hmm. Oh, you can go upstairs. I'll call you whenever you're done. Because if you sitting down here, you'll be down here for a minute. So you might as well hang out. Upstairs, do whatever you're going to do. Thank you for hooking me up. Twenty-two people watching, guys. Hit that subscribe button. Nobody hit that subscribe button yet. I don't know why. I like this. I like Streamlabs. I like Streamlabs. Come on, it's doing its thing. It's always what I want. It looks smooth, clean. The little pop-ups. It looks modern, right? You know what I mean? I'm glad I'm in my corner now because you now it's just me. You know what I mean? Instead of sitting on the couch and stuff. Definitely a 2022 look. I like it. I definitely like the 2022 fresh look. Got the music playing. We're doing good. Got fireworks popping. Where'd you get me? Oh, you didn't buy? No, well, yeah. We wasn't really there for all that, though, right? No, but I thought. Yeah, it's all right. I'll make it. <laughs> you said I'll die? You play too much. 28 people in here watching. Smash that subscribe button. You smash that subscribe button, you're going to see this. That's what you get when you subscribe to Straight Air Content. That's what you get. Smash that subscribe button, guys. It's round two of this rice versus coffee fight, but these guys are horrible. Like, they're trash. Like, they're just big, sloppy, slow. There's no action. They don't want to... 
right i'll give coffee a little more credit he looks like he wants to press the action this rice guy just looks like he just wants to just try to box on the outside and he's not even doing a good job on that 42 people watching let's go let's go who do you guys got who do you guys got ortiz or martin ortiz or martin who do you guys got hit that subscribe button guys start commenting yo spam my comments who do you guys got talk trash it's 2022 we're turning up we're getting 100,000 subscribers this year i got over 10,000 subscribers last year for 2021 so 2022 when i finish 2022 i want to be over 100,000 subscribers guys you guys are going to help me get there so you help me to get there by subscribing so i can give you guys dope content Yo, I know y'all see the wave, though. Yo, I'm the coolest dude on YouTube. Here we go. Like and subscribe, people. Love this channel about the shout out. Oh, I don't know why they try to block that. But I'ma show it. I'ma show it. Shout out to Jude. Shout out to my man, Jude. Shout out to my man, Jude. Hey, Jude. I don't know why... Like and subscribe, people. Love the channel. Shout out, Allen UK. GB Peace. Allen UK, I'm shouting you out. Allen UK. Allen from the UK. What's up? What's up? What's up? I got you. Who is this? Somebody said unnecessary something, but I missed it. Oh. Unnecessary boxing. Why you don't just show the fight live? Because that's illegal. And I'm not going to lose my channel. This is my money. This is how I get paid on YouTube. This is how I get paid every month. If I show the fight, I get kicked off. It's only $40. That's mad cheap. 40 bucks is cheap for a pay-per-view. Oh, oh, it was a no knockdown. Yeah, 40 bucks a seat. I don't know who's gonna win. Maybe the rice guy, because he's a little more aggressive. Let me know if y'all like that music, though. Let me see. Oh, that music is hard. Tell me you don't like that music. If you speak, if you speak, if you speak Filipino language, even if you don't show it, in life. Sorry, I don't speak Filipino language. Shout out to Manny Pacquiao. I'm voting for Manny Pacquiao. Are you voting for Manny Pacquiao for president? Manny Pacquiao for president. Let's go. How was y'all's New Year's? Y'all got 43 people in here. No subscribers. How was y'all's New Year? Yes, the fight has started. The prelims have started. Like, the the, the main card has already started. 
and I think they're in their second or third fight. This is Rice vs. Coffee, two heavyweight guys that aren't good. Like, at all. How do I watch the fight, Prince Doobie? Prince Doobie, you watch the fight by spending $39.99 for the pay-per-view. It's really cheap. Super cheap. $39.99. $39.99. Or you're going to listen to me do the play-by-play. -play. What do you guys think of Anthony Joshua training with Floyd Mayweather? 53 people watching. What's up? What's up? 2022-2022. Welcome to the boys straight out of content. We are here. We are here live for the Ortiz Martin fight. Let me know if you guys like my background. Michaela says, yeah. Let me know if you guys like my background. Smash that. Oh, 64 people. Okay, we turning up. All right, we turn up. Let me know if you guys like the music. Let me know if you guys like that music. I think it's a banger. Let's see what he said. Yo, his comments are, I, they're popping up on my screen before they pop up. Where's the fight though? You were gonna, oh, I thought you were gonna show it. No, we don't show the fight over here. This is how I get paid. YouTube is how I get paid. If I show the fight, it's illegal. They're gonna shut down my YouTube. Sup, dog? Has Frank uh, Sanchez and Christian Hammer happened yet? Nah, David, it hasn't. Let me, yo, who are those guys? I never heard of them before, so tell me who they are. I never heard of them. Are they good? It's on ESPN pay-per-view. I'm tripping. It's on Fox pay-per-view. I'm bugging out. You, you. David, who are those guys? I don't know who that Sanchez guy is. Are they good? Does anyone know what happening with the Charlo twins? I'm from the UK and try to follow them when I can. Hey Jude, I'm from Houston. I'm right here. I've been to the, I've been to Jamel's gym. Now, I've never, I haven't been to Jamal's gym, but I've been to Jamel's gym. Um, they're doing good. They're doing good. Um, Jamal got into some trouble in San Antonio. Uh, he's fighting a case, but I see them boxing sometime maybe in, in the uh, spring of this year. Gotta go, gonna watch the fight, not you. All right, bet, have fun, have, have fun watching the fight. What time is the fight? The fight, well, the, the pre-fights of the main card have already started. They're on the card tonight, yeah. Frank, I'm the I'm the Cuban with 19 and 0. Yeah, Sanchez is super good. He trains with Robert Garcia. Oh, really? Okay, I've never seen him before. Bet, nah, I'll tell you, so, by the time that fight comes on, I'll be, I won't have any, obviously I won't be eating, so I can give you guys play-by-play. -play. The Cuban Flash is super powerful and swift. Wow, okay. Are they building him to fight Luis Ortiz? Are they building him to fight Luis Ortiz? This guy Rice is, is smashing on this coffee guy. Looks like he's about to knock him out. He says, supposed to be. They need better promotions. Okay. Can he beat Luis Ortiz? These guys fighting right now are bummed. What are y'all doing?
up this coffee, guys. About to knock this rice guy out. This rice guy is running. This rice guy is running. Like, literally, literally running. He said, yeah, the Sanchez will be up next to be top of the elite of the division back. I can't wait. That sounds good. Sanchez, okay. All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to look out for him. Make sure I don't run over my cords. Yeah, I'm going to look out for the Sanchez guy. All right, guys, we got, he said, Martin is going to take the fight to Ortiz, though. I don't know. I don't think so. Charles Martin, to me, I mean, I know he got that knockout of that last guy with the body shot or whatever, but we've seen him in the, he just looks so frail. And Ortiz, you know, Ortiz is like, like, he's like a, he's a bomb. Like, think about it, his only losses is to De Deontay Wilder. In which, you know, in that first fight, he almost knocked Wilder smooth out. This chat over here is off. Oh, there we go. Happy New Year, champ. Happy New Year to everybody. Happy New Year. We got 61 people watching. Happy New Year, guys. Make sure you guys smash that like button. Make sure you guys smash that subscribe button. I've been blessed to meet a few champions. Something in Spanish. Yeah, Martin is going to get knocked out. I don't. If Martin goes five rounds, I'll be surprised. If Charles Martin goes five rounds, I'll be so surprised. I don't think Luis Ortiz lets him go five rounds. At all. This fight that's going on right now, though, is whack. More salmon than Ortiz. Little lighter on power punches. That's about it. I don't even know if he's got more stamina because Cuban fighters are known for their stamina. Oh, 12 rounder says Martin will knock out Luis Ortiz. Wow. 80 people in here, guys. Please smash that subscribe button. One, smash that subscribe button because if you do, I want to see if it does this. I want to see if you subscribe, if it does that, because I've got it loaded. I'm in Streamlabs now, and I've got it loaded to see if, if you do that, I want to see if that pops up, and if you do this, I want to see if that pops up as well. So, I've got everything up, alert box, super chat, I've got everything up, so theoretically, it should pop up if you do that. Theoretically, we'll see. I don't know. So go ahead, smash that subscribe button. Uh, let me know who you guys got. Let me know if you guys got Martin or Ortiz. Right now, 
in my comments. Happy New Year, everyone. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. It's the Woo. Sorry. <laughs> Happy New Year. Happy New Year, man. It's straight out of the content. You guys know the vibes. You guys know the vibes. It's straight out of content. It's straight out of content. You guys know the vibes. You guys know the vibes. You know where you can get all your merch at fcdvinylapparel.com. You can get all straight out of content merch. Straight out of St. Tama. If you are part of the Wolf Pack, go ahead and put that Wolf sign. Ooh, let's go. We got a big event tonight. First boxing event that I'm covering of 2022. You guys know what time it is. Let me know right down. Let me know right now in the comments. We got 81 people in here, so let's see if it's half and half. Let's see if it's 40 people versus 40 people. Let's see who we got, Ortiz or Martin. Ortiz or Martin, spam my comments now. Right over there, oh, right over there. I want, oh, right over there, I want to see uh, a bunch of comments, either Martin or Ortiz, Martin or Ortiz, Martin or Ortiz. You know what, in fact, don't put Martin or Ortiz. Put the gorilla sign or the king crown sign. Put the gorilla sign or the crown sign. Let me see, let me see who you guys got. I'm gonna start it off, you already know who I got. You already know who I got, guys. Let me go. I'm gonna go ahead and start it off. I'm gonna hit it with the crown. I'm gonna hit. Oh, I'm sorry, gorilla, gorilla, gorilla. I'm going with the gorilla all day. You guys already know what I got. I'm gonna go ahead and start it off. I started it off. I got the gorilla. All I, I even. I only need to see crowns or gorillas. Crowns or gorillas. Who you guys got? You guys got Prince Charles or you guys got King Kong? Let's go. Let's go. Glad to be a part of it. What's up, what's up? Yeah, definitely be a part of it. Definitely be a part. Straight of the content, you know what it is. Again, this Rice and Coffee guy are fighting. It's a six round, six of 10 rounds. These guys are bums. It's probably gonna go to distance. They're probably not gonna be putting on the card again because, oh, we got gorillas, we got gorillas. Where are the crowns? I don't see no crowns. Where are the crowns? Where are the crowns? Ortiz all day. Ortiz all day, thank you guys. Again, I'm looking, I don't know, maybe, I think people are subscribing, but for some reason it's not doing the, um, it's not doing the, uh, the membership thing. It's not doing the, da -da -ding, da -da -ding. all we got is gorillas, Dez, Dez, Dez with the gorillas, Dez with the gorillas. Let's go. Oh, snap, Martin and nine, David said Martin and nine. What? I can't believe people actually like Charles Martin. He's trash to me. <laughs> like he's trash. But hey, rep your rep your set, rep your team, whoever you guys got. You know what I mean? Stand on that. Stand on who you guys got. Always do that. That's what you could do here in the straight of the content room. But we got gorillas. I'm sorry. It's it's gorilla season all day. 2022 is all about the gorilla. It's all about the King Kong. That's my favorite movie. And it looks like Ortiz is smashing everybody. We got about 78 people in this room. And the it's obviously Oh, I see the wolf pack. I see the wolf pack. Um, it's obviously Ortiz all day. Gonna give us some boxing. Fifth, sixth round knockout. Vinny said. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep, Vinny. Jose Rodriguez. Ramirez is tripping. <laughs> he said Ramirez is tripping. <laughs> he is tripping. I don't know. Stay blessed, Ramirez. <laughs> That's funny. Jose is going in. Jose is going in. I don't know. What we're gonna see. I don't know. I don't think. I think Charles Martin is trash. Like this kid is trash. Like I don't. I don't know how he's a professional fighter. I don't get it. I don't know how. I just don't know how. I need to see if my cousin Darnell is watching. Let me see if cousin, if Darnell is watching. What's Darnell doing? It's Saturday too, so he, sh he should be off. Let's see what Darnell is doing. What are you doing, Darnell? Let's see if this turd picks up. Let's see if turd picks up. Darnell, pick up. Pick up the phone. He said, Jew, what does Americans really think of Tyson Fury? Also is, also Gorilla is knocking the Prince the F out. Bet. I like Tyson Fury. To me, I think he's top five greatest heavyweights of all time. Facts. Period. King Kong is under uh, KO Martin in round one. Yeah, exactly, Jose. He is. Nah, Jew, I think Tyson Fury is top five greatest heavyweights of all time. He, ever said... He, I, he, his scale of getting better compared to his competition and then his confidence and his belief in his skills, in his 
and he's like the definition of a fighter. Like he won't quit. Like he doesn't have that in him. He has no, he has no softness in him. Like he's really cool guy, stuff like that. But when it comes to fighting, he is a true fighter. He is the definition of fighter. Like he just wants to fight. Win, lose, or draw. He wants to fight. But he works so hard to beat you that he doesn't even he doesn't want to lose, man. I love him. I like Tyson Fury. I don't care that he's from the UK. I don't care nothing about none of that. Inside the ring is where, why I like him. So that's what I judge him off of. Rodriguez says King Kong is going to be going to KO Martin in round one. And also Fury is getting KO by Andy. Soon watch and see. Fury is solid, but he hasn't fought Andy style. I don't know. I think, I think Andy uh, Ruiz is an amazing boxer. I think Tyson is just too big. He said, yay, yeah, son. I'm going to show that. I don't know why YouTube blocked that comment. Yeah, Martin probably will. I'm out of shape. That's only because I'm out of shape. If I'm in shape, I'm knocking Martin the hell out. Now, Ortiz will be a tough fight. But Martin, no, I'm, I truly believe. We're the same exact height. I think he might be an inch taller than me. That's it. That's it. Outside of that, though, his, his the way he shoots his shots, the way he shoots his shots, it, I'd punch all in between those shots. It wouldn't even be a fight. I'd punch all in between those. If I'm in shape, I knock Martin out. It's not even close. Tyson Fury is a cheater. Is a cheater inside and out. Wilder won all them fights. <laughs> Yo, Jude, Jude, you got Jude. You gonna respond to that? <laughs> Jude, I need you to respond to that. Andy is getting Fury to drop to his level and getting and getting dropped. I don't know. I mean, he might get dropped because Fury does go down, but I don't think, I think all the experience that Tyson Fury has going up against Wilder, I think that really, that's really good going into the ring with an Andy Ruiz who's that much smaller. Remember, Andy Ruiz is the smallest heavyweight. Outside of Usyk, Andy Ruiz is the smallest heavyweight. So, I, I don't know. I think he's even smaller than Usyk as far as like height wise. And then he lost all that weight. I thought Andy Ruiz was better when he was fat. I really thought Andy Ruiz was better when he was fat. I'm just going to be honest. I mean, I know he went and got that, that stomach surgery. He went and got his stomach removed and he got that corset. And now he has a six pack with fat everywhere else. It's hilarious. I think his skills are good, but I don't I don't think he's active enough either. Jude, what's my man saying? Jude, Jude, you can't let him say that. I'm not gonna respond. I'm gonna let you, I'm gonna let Jude respond. Cause he Jude, you gotta respond to that. <laughs> yeah, thank you, Lee. Thank you, Lee. I appreciate that. Cause I think somebody's on drugs. Somebody is on drugs. I don't know who it is, but maybe y'all can see in the comments who's on drugs. 102 people in here, guys. 102 people in here. Let's go. We're here for 2022. We're here for the Ortiz Martin fight, guys. We are here. We are live. We are. Go I'm gonna give you guys the play-by-play -play, um, of the Frank Sanchez fight or whatever. But this the fight before that is whack. This fight right now that they're playing is whack. So I'm just hanging out with you guys in the comment section. We are laughing at certain people because certain people are really smoking crack, like for real. Like my man, like my man Lee said, somebody's hitting the pipe. Both these guys are in top. Athletic level despite any levels bar none just saying Ortiz ain't got it tonight I mean, yeah, and listen, yo, David, you gotta rock with your guy if you're going with Martin stand by Martin, man I appreciate that Um, Jose Rodriguez Has Tommy Tuckin. Yeah, he definitely got a tummy tuck. Definitely got a tummy tuck Those guys are clowns salute salute blue Muscle don't win fights yeah, I know. Muscle does not win fights in any way, shape, or form. We have learned. We have. That's the reason. Yeah, we have learned that time and time and time again. Muscle does not win fights. It can, but recently we have been seeing dad bods rule the world. Shout out to the dad bods. Shout out to the dad bods. I'm just smoking herb, bro. That's all. <laughs> that's it. That's all you smoking is herbs. Nah, I think we was talking to the Yan guy or whatever. Guys, I only got 19 likes. We got 115 people in here. Smash that like button. We only got 115 people in here. 
I mean, we have not only, we have 150 people in here and only 19 likes. Smash that like button, guys. Run these likes up so that more people can see this video and join our chat so we can have a bunch of fun. We can go crazy, we can talk trash. If you guys got the, if you guys got King Kong, you guys got Prince Charles, who you guys got, you know what I mean? I'm going with King Kong. This is definitely not King Kong versus Godzilla at all. Charles Martin is not Godzilla. Uh, Wilder's the, uh, Yas son says, Wilder's the best and the Division Fury had the, the complexion for the protection the second fight when Wilder knocked him down and his eyes rolled the back of his head they're supposed to stop it I don't know but you can't deny the third fight that's what you can't deny you have a you have an argument for that <laughs> you have an argument for the first fight you dang sure can't deny the second fight and you on God's green earth can't deny the third fight but somebody I just gave you number 19 oh bad 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 thank you we're up to 24, we're up to 24, we still got 110 people in. So we don't even have half as many likes. That means that y'all ain't liking what's going on. Y'all ain't liking the conversation, what's going on. I'm trying to keep y'all hype until we get to the to the to a good fight because what they're showing right now is trash. I'm sorry, it's whack, like it's straight trash. So, but yeah, no, I'm sorry, Wilder got beat. I'm sorry, I gave Wilder the first fight or a draw, but the other two fights, there's no excuse, he got smoked. I'm sorry, he got smoked. Yo, did did you put Ortiz on the money line? Nah, I don't, I don't, I don't bet. That's one thing I don't do. I don't bet. I do not bet, man. I apologize. Did you bet? Who who did bet? Who did? Uh, twenty six likes, guys. Come on, twenty six likes. We gotta run these likes up. We gotta run these likes up. We gotta get to at least fifty likes. A half of a hundred. We can get the fifty, right? We get the 50, it's 2022. We need to hit them subscribers though too. I really need to see, I don't think anybody subscribed because it says two hours ago, Joe, Joe Morgan subscribed. And you get this whenever you subscribe. That right there. Whenever you subscribe, you get that. You know what I'm saying? So I want to see you guys subscribe. You know what I mean? You know what I mean, Jelly Bean? Love Davis, number one in the lightweight division, strong as an ox. Definitely, Drew. Definitely. Tank Davis is number one, point blank, period. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. Third fight was passed. A 10 second count. Oh my God. A 10 second count for what? A 10 second count for what? For what? He got smoked. He almost got put out of there in the third round. Listen, there's there's no excuses. I mean, can anybody? Am I am I tripping? Am I tripping? Am I tripping? Did Wild <laughs> was there a ten count? Because I mean, I seen that video. I seen there's always. It seems like that there's always excuses. Just give him his credit. You know, he lost. Wilder lost. Fair and square. He lost. Okay, fair and square. He lost. That's cool. That's okay. It's not the end of the world. But don't do excuses and accounts and all this other stuff. Wilder needs to jab more. Head, head movement. He won all. He won all. Even Teddy Atlas sent said it was cheat. The third fight, it was past the 10 second count. Yeah, I'm sorry, but if even and that was in the fourth round, right? Right. So say, obviously it continued past the fourth round. But what happened in the third round? Where's the excuse for that? Where's the excuse for him getting knocked down in the third round? Where's the excuse for him? continuing to get beat after he knocks Fury down twice. Right? If I knock you down and then you knock me down, the fight's even. You still have an opportunity to win. How did he lose? How did he end up getting knocked smooth out? It went past the fourth fight. It went past the, it went past the fourth round. Where is the excuse after that? Wilder has no defense, and that's why. That's a fact. Uh, when he got knocked down, even Teddy Atlas saw it. What does Teddy Atlas have to do with anything? Honestly, what do you think of Jake Paul in the boxing world? I love Jake Paul, and I can hope he continues to fight, and I hope he continues to knock UFC fighters the F out. That's what I think about Jake Paul. I see the excuses. I hear the excuses. I hear a sore loser. That's what I hear. 
I hear somebody who couldn't beat a guy, so they have excuses. And then I see people make excuses for him. He lost. Because you don't have nothing to say what happened after the fourth round. He knocked down Fury in the fourth round twice. Why didn't he win the fight? Why didn't Fury, I mean, why didn't Wilder win the fight after the fourth round? Somebody please explain. Because he couldn't. That's why. He couldn't. That's the reason why. There we go. He subscribed. There we go. We got a subscriber. Enrique. We got a subscriber. Thank you, Enrique. 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 Subscriber, it works. It works. That's dope. It works. Oh, also, guys, if you guys hit that super chat, if you hit the super chat, you get notification. You get noticed on the channel. If you hit a super chat, you get noticed. Also by me, but it's cool. So that's cool. Thank you, Enrique. I appreciate it. All right, here we go again. Yan with the excuses. Son with the excuses. Son got mad excuses. Here we go. Fury is good character because any man that have to cheat no damn well, they can't beat the fighter no way type of fashion and the third fight wasn't no padding in the gloves. So there was, there's more issues with the gloves in the third fight, Mr. Sun? Is that what you're saying? That there's more Mr. Sun, are you saying there was more problems with the gloves in the third fight? <laughs> Is that what you're saying? <laughs> Yo, somebody get served. Hold on. First off, somebody smash that subscribe. I mean, somebody smash. Oh, we got another subscriber. Mr. Vlog, Zana 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 Vlog, another subscriber. Let's go. Let's go. Let's run up these subscribers. Let's run up these likes. Let's run up these subscribers. Let's run up these likes. I was gonna leave because you was talking about Wilder Bomb Squad, but uh but that but that beat in the back is dope enough to stay around. <laughs> Koch or uh, power. I'm just call you power, power, power. First off, I'm not talking about Wilder. First off, I love Deontay Wilder. Let me get that straight. I'm talking to this guy's son who's in the comments making excuses for Wilder and his loss. It's okay that he lost. That doesn't take away from the dynamite person and character and the man that Deontay Wilder is because look what he endured. A lot of guys would not be able to endure that for three fights in a row. Three fights, boom, boom, boom. Like nobody, like Deontay Wilder is a hero. He's, you know, to be commended. And sometimes you win some, sometimes you lose. That's fine. But yes, that dope, that beat is fire. I know, I know that beat is fire. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna just let the beat, I'm gonna just let the beat go. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, power, power. Please hit that subscribe button. At the very least, smash that like button, hit that subscribe button. I think Wilder need Mayweather to coach him. Yeah, unfortunately, uh, Mayweather's in Anthony Joshua's camp. You think Manny Robles is a good trainer? Who is that? Who is Manny Robert? Uh, To be honest, I believe Fury always cheat somehow. Devin, no, I don't, no. These guys aren't cheating. You're not cheating when you're, you're not cheating when you're also getting punched in the face. Because the other guy has a clean, smooth opportunity to win. It's not like that he's going in there and knocking guys out in the first round. Like, these guys have opportunities to win. And in all three fights, Deontay Wilder had an opportunity to win. He just didn't capitalize on it. Jude, hope Wilder does uh, come back. Still the most dangerous puncher from the first round to the 12th round. Could be great again. 100%. See, look at that. See, but the UK, the UK, y'all are smart. Y'all think with reason. It's hard for us over here to think with reason like a, U, like a person from the UK. So I understand. I understand. UK. Shout out to the UK. I will be over there. I will be in the UK. Ortiz KO, KO9. Wild is the king of the division. We don't accept cheaters. Okay. I mean, I don't know how he's the king of the division. He ain't got his belt. I know that. And he got knocked smooth out. He wasn't cheating then. Where was the cheat code when he got knocked smooth out? I wish I could show it. Power says, the fight was good, but the, uh, but the pros should be held up on points. 
when they hold too much like Flurry was, like Fury was, holding and leaning too much as a pro, just saying. Uh, David, <laughs> Devin said he got the gorilla all night. I mean, he got Kong all night. But I did like the third fight. Now, listen, listen. If I'm 200 and if I'm pushing 300 pounds when I walk in, I'm 6'9", I'm going to lean on you too. I'm 6'4", 258. If I'm fighting a smaller fighter, I'm leaning on them. And if they weigh, if I outweigh that fighter by 50 pounds, hell yeah, I'm leaning on them. Hell yeah, I'm leaning on them. It is going to be a lean type of night. Every time you come in, I'm going to put my weight on you. Lennox Lewis did it and did, ain't nobody saying nothing about Lennox Lewis. There ain't a person in this room that's going to say nothing about Lennox Lewis because every all y'all love Lennox Lewis. But come on, didn't he? He leaned on Mike Tyson the entire fight. That's a fact. Facts, Devin, they say we got excuses, but the man's that's talking got the excuses. How do I have excuses? He lost, and he got knocked smooth out two fights in a row. His ear was bleeding two fights in a row. That's not an excuse. That's just a fact. That's what happened. Fury has his belt. Fury's still undefeated. There's no excuses there. He won. You can't have an excuse for a winner. That doesn't make sense. Wilder the excuse the executioner. Ha <laughs> Lee, that's bad funny. Wilder the executioner. Facts. I, it's, it can't be lies if he won the fight. Can't be lies if we're looking at Tyson Fury's next fight. Both the same size, just not in weight. No, they're not the same size. One six seven, one is six nine. That's a fact. Deontay Wilder's six seven. Tyson Fury's six nine. Listen, it's all a part of the game. You have to, it takes punches. He didn't knock him out with a bear hug. Big shout out to the Kronk, Tyson Fury, suits, exactly, Jude, exactly. Jude knows what he's talking about. Jude knows what he's talking about. Jude's not speaking from uh, a hurt soul. <laughs> Jude's not speaking from a hurt soul. If his guy lost, his guy lost. Jude, if Tyson Fury lost, would you have an excuse or would you just be like, hey, he lost? You know what I mean? You'd be like, hey, he lost. Oh, it's okay. He lost. That's fine. People lose. That's okay. That is totally okay. Wild and Fury are just top guys and they both needed their own time. Exactly. And, you know, they both got their reign at their own time. Lord knows Wilder got their reign as heavyweight champion and most dangerous man in the world for a very long time while Tyson Fury was out. And Tyson Fury came back and smoked him three times. It is what it is. Oh, here we go. We got another subscriber. JJ, I'm going to just say J since that's the last. So we got another subscriber. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, guys. Thank you for subscribing. Smash that like button, guys. We got 100 and some odd people in here. We're up to 40 likes. Let's get up to 50 likes. Why is this guy dancing? He's a bump. All right, guys, so this fight is over, so we're looking at the next fight. We're looking at the, I think it might be the Frank Sanchez fight. Wilder lost, Wilder lost. I respect him after the third fight. Guy took the loss like a man. I'm not making excuses for him because he didn't make any excuses at all. Exactly, Devin, exactly. He didn't say Tyson cheated. He didn't say none of that. In fact, if anything, he was really the rude one at the end of the fight because Tyson went over her, Tyson went over to Wilder with respect and then Wilder didn't want to respect him. Wilder didn't want to shake his hand. It's like, yo, come on, yo. Like, come on, we just we just did history. Like, their fights are gonna go down in boxing history. It was already fight of the year as far as pay-per-view, as far as uh, PBC. PBC said uh, Wilder Fury 3 was fight of the year. Uh, Matt 02, I don't know what that means. Uh, Wilder really won the first fight. I thought Wilder won the first fight. I agree. Uh, that count should have you know, happened. Watch the man lay down. To the yeah, I thought Wilder won or draw. I thought won or draw. I thought if you knock somebody down that many times throughout a fight, you won the fight. But the second and third fight, Tyson Fury all day. And it, and it was Tyson Fury all day because he won by stoppage both fights. Sanchez is nice, man. Believe me, he has real skill and power. I think the Sanchez fight is next. I think the Sanchez fight is next. This guy who, this Rice guy is trash. Like, trash. 
He just, it's like he slaps with his punches. And he's like winging his shots. I don't understand how these guys get on TV. How do these guys get on TV? He's all throwing his arms up like he... Oh, we got another subscriber. Sue Pennigan. Sue Pennigan. Another subscriber. 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 Appreciate that. Appreciate that. We need the subscribers. We are getting to 100,000 this year. Frank Sanchez is next. There's Christian Hammer. Frank Sanchez is next, guys. So I'm going to pay attention to the fight. I'm going to pay attention to the fight because Frank Sanchez is next. I want to make sure that I give you guys the best play-by-play. -play. Frank Sanchez is next, guys. He is next. We are here. So I think after Frank Sanchez is the main event. So this is good. This is good. I'll try to read your guys' comments as much as I can. But we are here. Um, hopefully you guys can still see me because I'm leaned back in my chair. But we are here, guys. Frank, Ch Frank Sanchez is next. Uh, I'm excited. We got some people that know who he is. So I'm excited to see this kid fight. Let's see what this looks like. Yeah. I'm excited to see this kid fight. Hopefully he's a good fighter. Um, let me know. If, I'll turn down my music for probably if this fight starts I'll, or when this fight starts, I'll probably turn down my music so you guys can hear me clear. Malik Scott is good for Wilder. Showed him a few. Yeah, I think Malik Scott is good for Wilder. Do you do live MMA? Yes, I do. I, if it's a big MMA fight, I go live for MMA as well. Yes, I do. Yep. He could never beat Wilder. That's why he had to shoot. No, he beat Wilder. He knocked him out with his fist. Nothing else. Not like that. He went in there with a pistol or a pipe. He punched Wilder in the face and Wilder couldn't continue. That means I beat you. Nothing else. Point blank period. You signed on the dotted line under all circumstances. If you thought I cheated or if you thought he cheated, you didn't have to take the fight again. You didn't have to fight in litigation for the fight again. You didn't have to do any of that, but you did it. You did all of that to fight him again, and then you lost. Yes, UFC, yeah. I go live for all, all major UFC fights. Go look at my YouTube, you'll see. I go live for all major UFC events. So Frank Sanchez, 19-0 with 10 knockouts. Another subscriber! Power, subscribe. Thank you, bro. Power, 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 power. Thank you, power. Thank you for subscribing. Appreciate that, bro. Appreciate that. It's nice going to KO. Is Rice... Yeah, Rice won. Rice won. So they're about to do doing the Sanchez stuff right now. It's funny, you can only see my head. I should probably bring my camera. I think I've seen him. I think I've seen Sanchez fight before. Oh, yeah. He reminds me. He's like a little... little he's like a young Ortiz. I don't think... Is he that old? He looks young because Ortiz is 42. Oh, he's he's ripped. Who is this Christian Hammer guy? Is he good? Is this Hammer guy any good? Let me know. Who do you think wins, Ortiz or Martin? Oh, Ortiz is going to knock him out. I do not like Charles Martin. Oh, he's from Germany? Hammer is from Germany? Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't like Charles Martin. I, I don't know him as a man. I think he's like he's he was like he was like cussing at his way in. I was like, come on, man. Like, come on. You're on Fox. Chill out. Chill out. Just be humble. You're fighting Luis Ortiz, who knocks out everybody who he fights, except for Deontay Wilder. Like, chill out. This guy's in shape. 6'4. He's only 29. Yeah, I knew it. He's like a young Ortiz. 6'4, same size as Ortiz. He's a big guy. We're the same size. I can't hear how much he weighs, but we're the same size. He was like a shallow back, like a real, I don't know how these guys from Cuba are like built like gorillas because his back is really shallow. Oh, he's 239 and Hammer's 264 at 6'2". Wow. All right, I think it's gonna be a good fight. Show his punch and I like you. I like it, yo. Bet, bet, bet. Cause I'm gonna turn up. Let me go get some water so I can turn up for this uh, Sanchez fight. Let me go get some water because so my throat don't get dry. Give me one second.
Okay, here we go. Here we go, here we go. Oh wow, we got a lot of people in here, man. We got 149 people in here, let's go. Let's turn up, let's turn up. Go Bulls, go Bulls, let's go, let's go. This is boxing, bro, this is boxing. We are back, we are back. We got the um, Frank Sanchez fight next. Frank Sanchez is coming up right now, guys. You guys do not want to miss it, it's gonna be dope. I'm about to tell you guys exactly play by play what's happening. I got my water. We are all set. Make sure you guys smash that subscribe button, guys. Smash that subscribe button, guys. We're trying to get to, again, this year I will get to 100,000 subscribers. Watch me grow. The fast growing YouTuber, especially here in Texas. I'm the fast growing YouTuber, guys. You don't want to miss it. I'm already at like 12,600 something subscribers. Gained over 10,000 last year. I cover all boxing and UFC major events. I might even start covering other sports. I got my own store, fcbvinylapparel.com. We have a nice clothing and, a, and apparel, vinyl and apparel store. We do all types of stuff. We make custom merch. Also got some NFTs. I'll show you all guys stuff in between the fights. But as we get into this main event, or no, as we get into this co-main event with Frank Sanchez versus Christian Hammer, I'm going to give you guys the play-by-play. -play. Make sure you guys smash that like button. Smash that like button. You're killing it, babe. Thank you, Flash Custom Designs. Flash Custom Designs, make sure you guys go subscribe to my wife's channel, Flash Custom Designs. You guys can see all the work that we do, all the hard work that we put in. But yeah, we're about to turn up. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, we're at 50 likes, 50 likes, 50 likes, 50 likes. Yes, yes, yes. Let's go. Let's turn up. They're wrapped. Oh, wow. So they're already wrapping King Kong's hands. They're already wrapping King Kong. They're already wrapping Louis Ortiz's hands. That's dope. They're wrapping his hands. It's good. I like, I've always liked Luis Ortiz, even though he's lost to Deontay Wilder. Where are the excuses for Luis, Luis Ortiz when he lost to Deontay Wilder? Are there any excuses there? Did Deontay cheat there? Like, we don't hear nothing there. Why does this? Oh, yep. They're wrapping uh, Charles Martin's hands, too. No, I'm sorry. They're putting Charles Martin's gloves on. They're not even wrapping these guys' hands. They're putting their gloves on. So their hands are already wrapped. They're already locked and loaded, ready to go. They are locked and loaded, ready to go. Smash that, smash that like button, guys. Okay, so Hammer is walking in the ring right now. Hammer's walking in the ring. He is walking in the ring. 52 likes, guys. Smash that like button. Smash that. We got 132 people in there. Smash that like button. Let's get to 100 likes. Smash that like button. We've had, I think, a few thousand people watch this so far. Let's see. Let's see what my views are at. That was at 383. Let's see what these views are at, guys. Let's see what these views are at. As I refresh the views, we're at how many views so far, guys? Da, 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 As we load it up, we're at, oh, okay, a little over 33, 3,300 views, 3,300. Okay, so we're doing good, we're doing good. The main event hasn't happened yet, but we're doing good. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll get a bunch once the main event happens. We got 150 people in here, 152 people in here. Got, oh, okay, he's in the ring, he's in the ring. Sanchez is in the ring, let's go. The Cuban Flash, the Cuban Flash. The Cuban Flash is in the ring. Let's go, guys. Let's go, let's go. I can't wait. It's gonna be a dope fight. Where y'all where chats at, man? Where y'all chats at? I don't see no chat, I don't see nobody chat. He's got the no boxing, no life. Is he with Canelo? He's got the no boxing, no life hat. Oh, is that why Canelo's there? Is Canelo with Frank Sanchez? If he is, he's gonna knock this kid out. Jimmy Lennon Jr., let's go. Smash that like button, guys, 56 likes. Yo, we need, them, we need them subscribers to go up. We need them subscribers to go up. We need them likes to go up, guys. Smash that like button. Let's go, this German looks pretty good, though. Never know. You don't really see too many German fighters. Like and subscribe, people. Let's go. The party has started. Let's go. Is Shibu in you going to uh, point oh one? I don't know. Well, I'm with the Wolf Pack. You already know. Hey, listen, if you want to get your straight out of Saitama gear, FCB Vinyl and Apparel. If you want to get your straight out of Saitama merch, FCB Vinyl and Apparel. Let me see if we got the, um, let me see if we got the display capture. Where's the display capture? 
I'm gonna add the source, put this on the bottom. Let's not mess up anything yet. That's my display capture. Done. Oh, display capture at the bottom guy. I'm gonna go there. there we go. Display capture guys. And then it's the uh if you Final on the peril, guys. Final on the peril. All right. All right. They're about to fight. They're about to fight. They're about to fight. Here we go. I don't have time to show you guys. I'll show you guys my merch in between. I'll show you guys my merch in between, but here we go. They're about to fight. They're starting it. Alicia Keys, what's up? What's up? I got Sanchez. I got Sanchez, too. This kid looks like a young Ortiz. To me, he looks like a young, fresh. He's only 29 years old. He's a big guy, 6'4". You know what I mean? 239. He looks jacked like... This kid, he's with, it looks, I think he's with Canelo's camp because he's got that hat on. Cardio ready to the moon. Cardino ready to the moon. Two upright, stiff hammers going down early. Nah. Yeah, yeah, hammer's going to go down. Let's go. Here we go. Round one. Oh, so they go to touch gloves and Frank hits him with a jab. So Frank is coming out with his jab. Oh, wow. He's not Southpaw. He's a, he's a Cuban, but he's not Southpaw. Wow. Look at his boxing. Frank looks really good. Like his boxing looks crazy. He looks like he has the um, like this, the boxing skill of an Andy Ruiz. So Frank is standing there really tight, real sharp. He's, he's the, the German guy has not thrown any, uh, Christian has not thrown any punches yet. Frank with another, Frank with a big left hook. Missed, it didn't land, but Frank is just, Frank is just staying poised. Okay, so uh, Sanchez, I mean, Christian threw a jab to the body. Uh, uh, Frank blocked it. Oh, big right hand, but the hammer blocks it. Big right hand from Frank, but the hammer blocks it. Okay, Frank with a jab. Frank kind of leans, like, give him like a little, um, like a little faint. So, so really, the hammer is kind of pushing Frank back, but Frank is really more boxing with like lateral movement and stuff like that. They're not really throwing too many punches though. That really, they haven't really thrown too many punches. A nice little jab right there by Frank. Frank kind of resets. Frank throws a big right hand, misses. The guy, the uh, hammer guy, has his hands up high, so he's coming in with his hands up high. But the hammer guy is pushing Frank, like taking the fight to, to Frank. Oh, big right hand that landed by Frank. So the hammer guy ducked his head and threw some, threw some big shots, and Frank threw a big right hand, and then caught him on it right on top of his head with another right hand. They're back in the center of the ring. Uh, Frank with a nice little jab up top. Didn't really land, but it's just like a range finder. Like he's looking to shoot it out there and then land his right hand. Big right hand to the body by the hammer. And uh, Frank caught him with a one-two up top. Oh, nice jab. Nice push jab by Frank. Oh, nice right hand to the body by Frank. By Sanchez. Sanchez lands a nice right hand to the body. Okay. So the, the hammer tries to land. A, the hammer lands a nice jab to the body. Big right hand to the body by Sanchez. Big right hook to the body by Sanchez. Now Sanchez is up, up against the ropes. The hammer is really, he's the one who's pushing uh, Sanchez up against the ropes and stuff like that. But Sanchez is jabbing really well. So it's like Sanchez is wanting to box like this. He's, he's really boxing. Sanchez is really boxing. Does a nice little lateral movement. Gives some head movement. Oh, boom. Oh, oh, big couple jabs. Big little combination right there from Sanchez to put the fight in the back of the center of the ring. Um, every time Hammer tries to throw something, Sanchez has a Sanchez has a nice response for him. Ooh, Hammer tried to come in, and uh, Frank threw in like a nice jab and caught him over the top with a right hand, and then threw like a nice left hook, but missed the left hook. Now Sanchez has Hammer go up against the ropes. Ooh, they both throw big right hands. Hammer kind of lands his right hand when they both throw. It doesn't really hurt Sanchez, but he but he did land it. That's the end of the first round. That's the end of round number one. That's the end of round number one. Let me go over here to my um, display capture. Oh, then you know what? I can put this up here. Go over here to my display capture. Show you guys my website. Show you guys my website. is fcdvinylandapparel.com, guys. This is where you guys can get the Straight Outta Saitama merch. We're all right here. Straight Outta Saitama. Straight Outta Saitama. We also have... Um, you know, windbreakers, hoodies. We saw all blank apparel. We have all this stuff. So you guys can get that. If you represent the Wolfpack, oh, you get straight out of Saitama merch right here. And then if you want straight out of content merch, 
You can get it all right here. Also, we got the YWA. Again, I make everything. I make all the merch that you're seeing on the screen right now in my store here in Cypress, Texas, aka Houston, Texas. We got the uh, classic, but this can be, we have this hoodie in any color that you can, any color that you want. We also have the YWA, that stands for YouTuber Attitude, hoodies and shirts. Okay, guys, let's get back to the action. Okay, guys, so round two, round two. So, uh, right now, Hammer's coming out. Ooh, big combination, and Sanchez catches Hammer coming in with his head. So, Hammer comes in with his head down like this, and Sanchez caught him coming in with a right hand. All right, I'll try to sit up so I'm more on camera. So now Sanchez is like this. Sanchez is now taking a fight to, uh, to Hammer because he caught him with that big right hand. Now Sanchez is stalking Hammer, but he hasn't really thrown any punches, but he's definitely stalking Hammer. He's fainting with his shots. He's trying to land a big right hand. They clinch, they're in, they're in the clinch. That right hand kind of, Hammer's going like this to the back of his head, like the, like the shot landing on the back of his head. Sanchez has a nice little jab. I think, San, ooh, big left hook by Sanchez. Big right hand to the body by Sanchez. I think Sanchez can be a champion. Sanchez has the skills of a potential champion. It's just a lot of these other guys are big, but Sanchez has the skills of a potential champion. I just don't know if he can take a shot to the chin or not, but I'm telling you, from watching this guy, he has the skills of a potential champion. Okay, big uh, left jab up top, left jab to the bottom by Sanchez. Another jab. Another jab. So Sanchez really just controlling the fight with the jab. I'll do it to you guys. Controlling the fight with the jab. Another jab, that one misses. Ooh, jab right hand, that one misses. But he's controlling this fight. He's totally controlling the fight. Like, Hammer is just outclassed. Not that Hammer couldn't land a Hammer shot. I'm just saying that he's just being totally outboxed by Sanchez. Sanchez is moving laterally. Uh, look, he moved laterally to the left, moved lateral to the right. Missed, uh, Hammer threw a right hand and he missed. Ooh! Oh, big, see, Hammer keeps ducking his head and, and Sanchez keeps landing a big right hand. Every time Sanchez ducks his head, Hammer lands, I mean, every time Hammer ducks his head, Sanchez lands a big right hand, like he can time it. But he's hitting him on top of his head though. It's weird the way that this guy fights and the way he fights with his head down. But um, Sanchez is landing right on top of his head. Sanchez with the, with the jab up top. Again, it didn't really land, but he's just using it as a as a range finder. Sanchez is using his jab as a range finder and then kind of fighting off of that. But he's definitely, oh uh, yeah, he's hitting him with the feints. He made Hammer back up with those three feints. So he he's just trying to time Hammer with a nice, he's trying to time Hammer with a nice shot. And he's really killing him with the feints right there, perfect. He feinted him, feinted him, kind of threw his left jab and then caught him over top with a right hand. Sanchez is really boxing really well. And every time Hammer comes in, he comes in with his head down and Sanchez makes him pay. Let me turn down my music so that you guys can hear me. Let me see. Turn me there you go. You guys can hear me better. Oh, big, another big straight right hand by Sanchez to the body of this Hammer guy. Oh, the Hammer slams his gloves together like, slams his gloves together like less fight. That's dope. Yeah, it's a, this is a good fight. I don't see Robert Garcia, though, in the corner. Okay, now they got Charles Martin uh, in the locker room doing his pad mitts. Doing his mitts. The way he fights is weird. Like, the way he shoots his right hand is really weird. And then here we go. Here we go, King Kong. Here we go. Here we go, King Gun. They're both southpaws too, so this is gonna be a dope fight. I think I don't I don't see Luis Ortiz letting this fight go five rounds. I think he's gonna knock Charles Martin's block off. Don't material, David. Thank you, thank you, thank you, guys. Smash that subscribe button, guys. Hit that like button. We're only at 61 likes, guys. If you guys like what I'm doing, if you guys like the effort that I'm putting in, please consider subscribing and hitting that like button. Or even help support your boy with a super chat. Let's go in round three, round three. Uh, Sanchez with a couple jabs to start the round. They don't really land, but he's just, again, he's using his range finder right there. Big right hand by Sanchez that that punches through the uh, guard of Hammer. Hammer kind of hits his uh, gloves together like, let's fight. Now Hammer's kind of coming in, trying to make it a fight. And Sanchez with a big jab right hand by Sanchez, and he goes back and resets and then comes back with another jab. 
Sanchez's boxing is really good, especially for a heavyweight. He looks like a light heavyweight. Oh, J Sanchez with the jab and then the hook off the jab. Sanchez is really boxing. Great lateral movement. This Sanchez kid is really impressing me. He is really a good boxer, a good heavyweight boxer. I think, I think he's going to be a problem, especially at 29 years old. He's the youngest uh, in the heavyweight division. He, they kind of lean, and he gives a big Canelo left hook to uh, Hammer. It doesn't look like he's able to – he hasn't hurt Hammer yet. He's hit him with some big shots, but he has not hurt Hammer yet. Nice jab right there by Sanchez. Again, also another thing that Sanchez might want to not do is box so much up against the ropes because he's up against the ropes a lot in this fight. He's letting Hammer bring the fight to him. And maybe he boxes well like that, especially in the Cuban amateurs. That You know, they have really good boxing pedigree. Ooh, Hammer tries to land a, a right hand to the body, but Sanchez moves right out of the way. His boxing ability and his leg movement is really good. This is really good for him to only be 29 years old in a heavyweight. I think he can uh, do really good in a heavyweight division. Ooh, he faked with the left hand. Ooh, he's digging to the body. I think he hurt Hammer with that left body shot. I think he hurt Hammer with that left body shot. He hits him with another body shot. Hits him with a right hand body shot. Hammer backed up against the ropes. It looks like the Hammer's hurt. Uh, he was hurt with that left hook to the body by Sanchez. A minute and 13 left in the, in the third round. Uh, now Hammer is trying. Oh, a nice jab to the body by uh, by Sanchez, and it pushed Hammer back like he felt it. Um, he Hammer's trying to throw big right hands and stuff like that. Hammer's trying to throw haymakers in order to catch Sanchez, but Sanchez is just breaking him down with these awesome body shots. He's really hurting him with these body shots. So here we go. It's 48 seconds left in the third round, guys. Sanchez is boxing really well, hitting him with feints. Now they're clinching again. Make sure you guys smash that like button, guys. Please smash that like button, guys. Smash that subscribe button, guys. Let's get these likes up if you guys are liking the content that I'm doing. Now Sanchez is pushing Hammer back. Big right hand by Sanchez. Uh, Hammer kind of catches it on the guard. But as you can see, ooh, Sanchez keeps digging to the body and Hammer can see it. Like, Hammer is nodding his head like, ooh, Hammer hits Sanchez on the, Hammer hits Sanchez on the clinch. 20 seconds left, guys, in the third round. Uh, Hammer now is just trying to just do, like, dirty boxing and really big wide shots. Ooh, nice right hand to the body by Sanchez. Whoever taught Sanchez, wow. Hammer pushes Sanchez over the ropes and throws a punch. And the referee's like, yo, don't do that. So now Hammer's just fighting dirty. That's basically what he's doing. Good investment to go to the body. Yeah, no. He is really killing this Hammer guy to the body. I might have to re-up on my water. Man, that was, a, that was a really good round. It'll be a hell of a comeback if Hammer slugs that Cuban, I know. That would be crazy. So Hammer's in the corner. He's acknowledging the fight. He's acknowledging, but I need you guys to smash that subscribe button. Definitely smash that like button, guys. We need to get these likes to 100 likes. But again, let me move this up here. I'll put this under my webcam. There we go. So like this. What? Wow. Here we go, guys. So you guys can see. Yeah, guys. So, again, this right here, this is all my merch. <coughs> FCD Vinyl and Apparel. If you guys want to buy any of the merch, YouTube or Attitude merch or anything, or straight out of St. Thomas, guys, definitely check that out. We are going into round four. Round four. Round four. Round four, guys. Round four. Round four. Round four. Nice jab. Nice jab. Hammer's bringing the fight to Sanchez now. He came straight out, and now that... Beautiful lateral movement by Sanchez, left and right. Like, that's the classic. That's the basics in what you learn in boxing. If you've ever fought before, I have. If you ever fought before, those are the basics that you learn. You do that. You do that move around the ring. You never let your feet cross. And his movement is really good. His boxing basics and fundamentals are amazing. Big right hand by Sanchez that missed. He kind of tried to catch a uh, hammer with like an uppercut slash hook. It missed, but it was a really good shot. Now, ooh, Hammer throws a jab, and uh, Sanchez tries to counter him with a huge left hook. But again, Sanchez is fighting off of the ropes. Now Sanchez has turned southpaw. Now Sanchez has went back to orthodox. Again, everything that Hammer is throwing, he hasn't thrown anything effective. I don't even know if he's hit Sanchez with anything effective. But every time he comes in, once again, he comes in with his head down. So it's a very hard fight to fight whenever you got somebody coming in his position. He doesn't have to. He's had the guy hurt with a few shots. I think if Sanchez were to just sit down on some of his shots, he would get this guy out of there. Nice little jab by Sanchez. But again, he's boxing off 
of the ropes. I don't know why Sanchez continues to go back to the ropes and put his back on the ropes and allow Hammer to come in. I don't know why he's doing that. That's something that I do not know why. Nice jab uh, by um, by Sanchez, but every time Sanchez throws a jab, Hammer just rushes him and grabs him. Hammer's not landing anything. Hammer's just rushing in and grabbing him. Ooh, big left body shot by Sanchez. Big left body, uh, body shot by Sanchez. Sanchez dug to the body again, just missed with a big left hook. So Sanchez isn't even trying to hit uh, Hammer in the head. He's just scraping his body with left hooks. And now Hammer backs up. Hammer sees Sanchez go to the ropes, so now Hammer is backing up. So now Hammer is backing up to the ropes himself. Now they're back in the center of the ring, and Sanchez switched let southpaw, then he switched back to orthodox, threw a nice little jab and landed it. Sanchez is just moving too much for me. As a heavyweight, um, he almost got caught with that shot. So Hammer threw a right hand and missed because right when Hammer threw his right hand, Sanchez threw his left hook. But seven seconds left in the fourth round, guys. I don't... I. I like the way that Sanchez is boxing, but he's boxing like like an amateur instead of taking this guy out. He's right there. Like, Sanchez can take Hammer out, but it's like he's just not putting it on him, guys. Let me go get some water. Yes, you guys are here for commentary. The best commentary in the game, guys. Don't forget it. The best commentary in the game. Straight out of content. Bang! <laughs> All right, guys. All right. Round five. Round five. Let's go. Smash that like button. Smash that subscribe button, guys. Round five. Round five. Sanchez is winning every round. He hasn't lost, even come close to losing a round in any way, shape, or form. He's totally controlling this fight, guys. Um, I think, like I said, it's heavyweight boxing. They put all these heavyweights on this broadcast for a reason to get a lot of knockouts. Um, he's obviously the co-main event. He can knock Hammer out, but he's choosing to box. I don't know why, because the hammer has not thrown enough punches to make it a fight. This entire fight has been all, oh, big counter right hand that caught hammer. It made him wobble a little bit. Hammer went to duck his head in and Sanchez caught it, timed him with a beautiful right hand on top. And then he just goes back to boxing. I don't know why he doesn't keep kind of pressing the shots. It's like he's trying to catch hammer with a knockout with like a flash knockout type of punch you know what I mean not like a, an accumul a, an accumulation of punches to stop hammer he's just boxing like he's literally backing up it's a fifth round he's winning this fight 100% but he continues to back up now he's taking the fight to hammer and he's pushing hammer back but now they're just in the center of the ring and then he starts to back up again I don't know why he's backing up I know he's it seems like he's a counter puncher but you if the guy you're fighting isn't punching, which Hammer is not punching, Hammer hasn't thrown maybe two shots this round. If you're if the guy you're fighting isn't punching, then it's your job to make it an offensive fight because this guy is not there to punch. So I don't know. Like the fight doesn't look as if this guy Hammer is not making the fight look good. He's not like he's not punching enough to make the fight even a fight. It's more of just Sanchez just boxing very smart. But Sanchez not turning it up to knock this guy out. Because he could he's hurt him every round. Especially with the body shot in the third round. Right now, all he's doing is jabbing and boxing, just jabbing. He almost looks like a Devin Haney. Sanchez right now is fighting like a Devin Haney. That's exactly how he's fighting. Who was texting me? What is this? Oh, I'm a ch oh. What is this?
Ew, Chelly. Are you serious? Are you serious? I just saw your link that you sent me. Yeah, that's the one that was with the old man. With the lid. Yeah. Yeah. How are they dating? She's still in jail? Yeah, she she reached out to him and he couldn't resist. <laughs> oh <laughs> my resist. god. Yeah. So was it coming out? He's no, a- I saw the, the next season's uh, clips. It's no it's actually it's called um, Love. While locked up or something. Oh. Uh, so next season is all new people. Oh. Uh, yeah. That's mad funny. That's He's such a bum. Yeah. I, I was like, I, I wasn't going to send it, but I was like, that's the boy. So, no, it's definitely not. That's yours. That's yours. So, hold on. So, what happened with him and the other girl? Uh, uh, he showed up at their wedding and ruined their wedding. At the, oh, with her when she's with the girl? Oh, so she married the girl? Yeah, and then he showed up and then, oh, the, the that girl. Man, Watch what you're saying on camera. Oh, uh, they got into a fight. Oh. Like a fist Who, the two girls? No, the uncle and the other girl. They got into a fist fight? Yeah. What? At the wedding. At the, what? That's crazy. Anyway, guys, we're in round six. Sanchez is winning this fight smoothly completely on boxing but again it's starting to get a little dull um especially for a heavyweight fight it's getting really dull because he's moving way too much instead of just taking the fight to hammer and getting him out of there he's just moving way too much like he and he's fighting like this and hammer could throw something and knock him down like and change the whole fight because he's not he's not doing enough He's just doing like the he. I swear to God, he, this fight looks like a Devin Haney fight, like just enough just to win. Like that's it. I'm not gonna win by anything else by just moving around, boxing, punching. That's it. Nice right hand, but it's not like that. He can't stop this guy. He's 29 years old. He's still in his prime. He should be able to stop this guy easy, and he's not. So I don't know what's going on. I don't know. I mean, I like him. This man trains with Canelo team. He knows boxing. Yeah, I know. I know. It looks like that he trains with Canelo, but if Canelo doesn't fight like this, Canelo's not going to back up if he's if he's smashing on a guy and this guy has no response for any of his shots. And that's exactly what's happening. You're totally right, Jose. I mean, he trains with them, and he looks like a really good boxer. And he's boxing. He's up on his toes right now, and he's throwing the jab, and he's looking for tremendous, but he's a heavyweight. So where's the, uh, like, you know what I mean? Like, where's the punching power? He's only got 10 knockouts, too. That's, what I, that's another thing that I noticed. He's, he's what, 20-0 and 0 with 10 knockouts or something like that? So he's, he, you can just see that his power isn't that high. What's up? Do you need anything on my mouth? Nah. Oh, you down? You, you back to normal? Yeah. <laughs> Your eyes are. Uh, no, I've been getting myself water. You want water? No, I've been getting myself water. Oh. I kind of wanted like a snack or something. I don't know what we got. Snack? Yeah. You can run uh, like one or two more water cycles. That water right there shouldn't be soapy, is it? Oh, I don't know. And you already cleaned out the filter. It's not moldy or nothing? Yeah. I figured we, I, me letting it sit in sanitizer and vinegar should be good, right? Really? Yeah, it was so all that gunk was like floating. Oh my god. I need a beer, my man. I got you. Not trying to start anything, but maybe Sanchez figures out he won the fight on points and he will cruise through the rounds. You deserve a beer. I know I do deserve a beer. Thank you, bro. I appreciate that. You know, you can send a beer, you can send one of these. A beer. There you go. That's my beer. That's my digital beer. Go ahead and send some. Send some of those. Oh, yeah, you got wine. Oh, I thought you didn't just do it because of. No, because I had eight. 
156 people in here. Let's go. Let's go. Hit that like button. Hit that. Yeah, go ahead. Hit that wine, mama. I told you what I wanted you to do. What do you want? Uh, I don't want nothing. <laughs> Sanitize with a pre-alcohol, bro. I don't have any of that in the house. Oh, sanit oh, sanitize with pure alcohol. Yeah, you're right. Are they going to stop the fight? Oh. Yeah, Sanchez is winning, but it's the round seven, and all he's doing is just... Hammer's the one who's making the fight even closer. I want a bag of chips, but I want to be crunching on camera. Take a shot, bro. Nah, won't be taking a shot. Nice right hand by Sanchez. Now Hammer's starting to make this fight more of a fight. I don't know what's taking him so long, but now that Sanchez isn't moving so much, now Hammer is grabbing him and kind of doing dirty boxing. He's still getting totally outclassed, though, by this guy. What are you doing? Yeah, this fight is almost over, and then the main event. Yeah, the main event is next. What time is it? Oh, it's only 10. It's early. Yeah. I still got time. You want to go to the gym? Yeah. Oh, that's a you lit. Ew, how you going to fart and take the picture? <laughs> Nasty. Oh, big left hand, right hand shots by, by Sanchez in the corner, and then he backs up. He literally backs up. He had a hammer in the corner and then backs up. And then Hammer doesn't throw nothing. Hammer threw one body shot. That's it. They really got to ma like, really match make these guys better. Like, they, they're, they're, the way that they're matchmaking these guys isn't to make, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I don't think Hammer's going to get nailed. No, I don't keep tequila or Hennessy. I don't drink. I'm a square, buddy. I don't drink. I've never smoked or anything a day in my life. I like juice and water. That's what I like. And soda. And good Italian food. That's what I like, buddy. All right, guys. I'm, it's round 48 seconds left in the seventh round. Sanchez is totally outboxing his hammer guy. Nice big right hand by, by Sanchez. The guy waves his head like this. The crowd is getting hyped. And then he backs up. Every time Sanchez lands something, he backs right up. I've never seen that a day in my life. Except for with Devin Haney. Like, he boxes and then he backs up. Why are you backing up? When you're winning and beating this guy to the punch and everything. He's trying to bait Hammer in, but Hammer doesn't throw anything. I drink coconut water in, in body armors, like they drink body armor, but I don't just drink coconut water. It, but it's in body armor, and I like the drink body armor, and I like Gatorade. But outside, outside of that, I don't, drink, I don't drink bad stuff. I don't do bad stuff. Fast food, I guess, is the only bad thing I do. Yeah, fast food. It's the only bad thing I do. Yeah, and it's weird because I see Reynoso in Sanchez's corner, and if I'm Reynoso, I'm telling Sanchez, knock this guy out. You should have been stopped him. He's not throwing anything. He don't even throw nothing back. Look, they're showing the replay. You're teeing off on him. He's not even throwing nothing back. Like, this guy has nothing on his face. Drink it, it's pure, it's cold hydration, better than Gatorade. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why I like um, body armors, because they're, they got that coconut water in them. Outside of just regular old water. It's the best you can get. Filtered. My wife is always telling me to drink more water. Round eight. This is really going a lot longer than it's supposed to. I don't think it should have went that long. Or went this long. There's no way it should have went eight rounds.
If he KO everyone, no one will fight him. No, again, I don't think he should KO everyone. I'm not that type of guy. Like, it's cool if you whoop a dude's butt, right? Totally outclass him. I love I love those performances. We we got to see Andre Ward. Andre Ward is a classic person from whooping your butt the entire round. I mean the entire fight. But this isn't that. Like, Sanchez is really like moving too much. And he keeps walking back like he's walking back away from hammer right now and he's totally smashing on him he's everything he throws he's landing on hammer but he's walking away from him it's like just move forward and just stop him you can you totally can if you just put it on him i could see if if hammer was throwing a lot of shots and was really busy and you had to move like this in order to win the fight that makes sense but if he doesn't have to move like this in order to win this fight, the way that Sanchez is fighting, he doesn't have to. He could just sit down on his punches and get Hammer out of there. Even if he doesn't get him out of there, he could at least be dominating the fight in like a more um, in a more physical fashion. He's only dominated his fight right here with movement. As he's moving left and right, and then he throws like a little jab, and then he'll wait and then throw a nice right hand like there, and then nice jab coming in. And then Hammer comes in with his head down, wild shots, but Hammer's tough. So everything that Sanchez is throwing isn't enough to stop him. What I'm saying is you're not going to be able to fight. If this was Andy Ruiz, say they put Hammer, or say they put Sanchez in there with Andy Ruiz, Andy Ruiz might stop Sanchez because Andy Ruiz is going to be coming forward with punches and with great boxing fundamentals and stuff like that. So if you think you're going to, but then again, they're in the same camp. So how do they even fight each other? So I don't know. I don't know. Wilder, if he were to fight Wilder, if they were to do like a, if Wilder were to come back against Sanchez, I think Wilder would have knocked him out by now because he keeps boxing, boxing going backwards. And it don't look like he got enough heat to knock him, to knock this dude out. And we seen Wilder. If Wilder can knock out King Kong, I think he can knock out Sanchez. I think it'll be a good fight for Sanchez's career. But if Wilder can knock out Luis Ortiz twice. Uh, I think it'll be a hell of a fight for Sanchez. But, you know, I think it'll be a big pay-per-view. I think Sanchez Wilder will make a good fight. But if I'm Wilder, I'm looking to come back against Sanchez. Uh, undefeated name on my record. Uh, same exact size as Luis Ortiz. I think it'll be a good fight. What do you think Sanchez should... What round do you think Sanchez sh should have finished Hammer? Even if he doesn't finish him, I'm not saying he has to finish him, but he can at least stop moving backwards with a guy who you're totally outboxing. You can stand in the pocket like with a Shakur Stevenson and um, and Jamel Herring. Like, he didn't go anywhere. He wasn't going in there to knock Herring out, but he didn't move. He stood right there. Even like a Lomachenko. Lomachenko will stand right there in front of you with great head movement and body movement, stand right there in front of you and take the fight to you. Even at Cam, look at the Cambosis fight. Like, you can knock this dude out or you can at least make it a hell of a fight even more, but you don't have to keep moving back. And I don't know why this Sanchez guy keeps moving back. Like, he's starts to look, and now he's moving back. And he doesn't have to. He's bigger than this guy. He doesn't weigh more, but he's, he's bigger than he's three inches taller, they're both heavyweights, but he's obviously way stronger than this guy is because he's been hitting this kid all night. He's been hitting Hammer all night, and Hammer has no response. So just keep piecing him up and then, like, make the referee jump in and stop the fight or something. Like, he's not even doing that. He's not even put, it's like putting it on him. That's the term. He's not putting it on him. Yeah, I think Wilder Sanchez would be a good fight. Wilder Sanchez or Wilder Ruiz, I think, make two great pay-per-view fights. I would like to see them. I think Wilder's gonna wait till one of the till somebody unifies the champion or something like that. He, I think Wilder doesn't want to find anybody unless you got a belt. I personally believe that. I personally believe Wilder that will not fight anybody unless they have a belt. I don't think he wants tune ups. I don't think he wants any of that. I think Wilder wants to fight somebody with a belt. And I think he's willing to stay out and keep training until he can.
Nice left hook. Nice left hook to the body. And then this hammer guy just laughs. Yeah, this fight's going the distance. Yeah, it's a showcase of skills, but compared to the other heavyweights, I mean, what are you really showing? Welterweights fight like this, not heavyweights. It looks good, but again, it's, a, it's against a no-name guy in Hammer. Nobody knows who Christian Hammer is, and we won't see him again on TV. You know what I mean? So maybe he could, maybe Sanchez can fight the guy who knocked out that, uh, who knocked out that Polish kid. Does anybody know his name? Remember the bald Polish guy from New York City that got that just got stopped? Whoever knocked him out, maybe Sanchez to fight him. They're both PBC fighters. See, right now Sanchez is taking a fight to Hammer. He's got Hammer up against the ropes, and Hammer is kind of running around the ring. He can stop him, but he just won't. The referee is looking at Hammer like he's almost done. And then Hammer keeps grabbing Sanchez. Oh, oh, big left shot to the body by Sanchez. Can he stop him? 28 seconds left. Can he stop him? Can he stop him? Oh, now the ref is saying something to Sanchez. Can he stop him? Can Sanchez stop Oh, big right hand by Sanchez that pushes a hammer back. Hammer comes back with his hands up high. Can he stop him? Can, can Sanchez keep going to the body? Big right hand. Another jab. Does something with his legs. And it's the end of the ninth round going into the last round. Hammer is, I don't know. I don't, I don't know what they're saying to him in the corner. Did he cut him? No. Looks like Hammer's got something in his right eye. Sanchez is still standing. Ruiz Sanchez, it would be like you said Ruiz, Ruiz would be coming in with his head down to punches. Yeah, I know, but, you know, I don't think, you know, does the Canelo camp allow those two to fight each other? I don't think so. I don't think so. So, if anything, they would, you know, those are the two front. I think a Sanchez and a, a Ruiz are the two front runners front runners for a Wilder fight. But I don't see Wilder taking that fight because there's too much to lose for Wilder right now. Wilder is still in the ranking, still in the runnings for a title shot against whoever it may be. Fury, Joshua, he's still in the rankings for a big major fight. If he loses to a Sanchez or to an Andrew Ruiz, then he's going to, there goes his big money. Everybody's going to say, nope, you, you've lost too much. We don't want to see you in a big fight. You're going to have to earn it. Right now, he doesn't have to earn it. With his performance against Tyson Fury, he can sit back and let the dust settle and, you know what I mean, get the, even get the, oh, big right hand by Sanchez. Hammer has to hold on. Two minutes and 22 seconds left. Hammer has to hold on. Two minutes and 20 seconds left. Can, can Sanchez do it? Another big right hand pushes Hammer back. He definitely hurt him. This is what I was saying. This is right here. Big right hand to the body by Sanchez. This is right here. This is what I was saying. Now, all Sanchez had to do was just put the just put it on him and you'll stop him. Just put him out, put it on him and you'll get this guy out of there. This guy isn't throwing billions of punches back at you. This isn't Mayweather Maidana. This isn't a durable guy. This is a guy who's just in there just to be in there. He's obviously shown that he's in there just to be in there. He's not throwing anything. Get this guy out of there. Get this guy that we will never see Hammer again on TV. He's not, he's just in there to make Sanchez look good. So look good against him and get him out of there. He's not a tough guy. He's been where he's been getting rocked with all your shots all night. Minute 35 left in the 10th round. Let's see. Can Sanchez close the show? Again, he's moving back. Again, he's moving back. Big left hook to the body. Big right hand to the body. The guy is kind of catching everything with his elbows. Hammer's catching everything with his elbows. Big right hand counter by Sanchez. The referee's looking at, at Hammer. But Hammer looks fine. A big right, right hand faint by Hammer, but he didn't th actually throw the punch, but it looked like he was. A right hand faint by Sanchez. A big right hook by Sanchez that misses. 
Nice little left hook by Sanchez that kind of kind of grazed Hammer, but not really hit him. Hammer is now, oh, no, here we go. Sanchez chases Hammer around the ring, and Hammer comes in with his head down like a spear right into uh, Sanchez's chin. So this Hammer guy is really trying to win, win with his head. He keeps coming in with his head. Yes, yeah, this hammer guy is really trying to cheat. Oh, was that a knockdown? Was that a knockdown? Oh, that's foul. That wasn't a knockdown. So the hammer guy fell and the referee counted it as a knockdown. Wow. That wasn't a knockdown in any way, shape, or form. I mean, Sanchez won every round, but that was not a knockdown. Don't, don't, that, that's not cool. That wasn't even close. Oh, it was. Sanchez caught him with a left hook. And he like slipped and went down. Okay, when they showed the replay. This hammer guy is clapping like he won. I don't know. Here we go to the main event. I would like to see personally. I would like to see a Sanchez. Again, I maybe I don't want to see. I don't want to see a Sanchez and a Wilder because I don't want to see anybody versus Wilder unless he's fighting Ruiz, Usyk, or Fury. Because anybody else, if they beat Wilder, we'll never hear from Wilder again. And he'll retire, and I don't want to see Wilder retire. I think Wilder has one more classic fight in him, and I think that's against Anthony Joshua. Just for the sake of boxing, we have to see Wilder and Anthony Joshua. Whether or not Anthony Joshua loses again, and then we get to see a mega fight with Anthony Joshua and, and uh, Wilder in America, I think with, with titles or without titles, I think, I think we're all deservant of that fight, personally. That's just me. I think we're all deserving of a Wilder Joshua fight. I'm ready for the main event too, bro. I am ready. I am ready for the main event. We are ready. Let me see what this looks like in 1080. Oh, what? Oh, it's not in 1080p? What? Why well, won't it go to 1080? It's only 720. I need to change that. I thought it would be in 1080. Yeah, I need to change my output settings. I don't like that 720. Sanchez won all rounds. Here we go, guys. Main event. Sanchez won. Sanchez won, guys. Again, a little Devin Haney-ish. A lot of big shots landed, but couldn't get him out of there. He did drop him, but. What is the time in America? It is 1014. And it's, we have different, we have like five time zones here in America. So it's not like one time for all of America. So here in Texas, it's 1015. In New York, or 1014, it's here in Texas. In New York, it's, uh, damn. Luis Ortiz has seven losses? Holy snap, I didn't know that. Uh, it's, uh, how does Charles Martin have 25 knockouts? Who the hell is he knocking out? In New York, it's 1115. In what, Colorado or like Montana, it's 915. Or Nevada, it's 915. California is what, 8 or 7.15? So it's different time zones here in America. It's not all the same time. Who is winning main event? Does Martin have a chance? I don't think Martin has a chance, personally. Even though I don't know how the heck this guy has 25 knockouts. I don't know who he fought that he knocked out. 
outside of that last guy, but he don't have the leg movement or anything. Here we go. They're showing Ortiz warm up. They're showing Ortiz warm up. King Kong warming up. Yeah, no, I think I, I don't. Martin doesn't have the legs to get out of the way of what Ortiz is going to bring. He's just like Charles Martin is just like, like just like weird, like with his movement, like it's not, it's nothing sharp about him. Nothing sharp about him. He looks like a football player or a basketball player that learned boxing late. Wild with his shots. Definitely doesn't have an amateur background like um. Let me turn on my mic if it's too loud. He definitely doesn't have an amateur background like like Luis Ortiz does. Oh, it's 416 here in the UK. I think Ortiz Camp said they, they – yeah, they'll do it before the eighth round. I think fifth round max. I don't see Charles Martin being able to stand with this guy for that long. Like 416 in the morning because you just gave military time. Like AM or PM. The dude got a slipknot shirt on. At the heavy former IBF. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I don't even know what IBF champion he was. Like what like was he super champion, regular champion? Two time world heavyweight title challenger. Oh wow, so Luis Ortiz was never a champion. I bet you Luis Ortiz got some money. I bet you he does because he's fought, especially those two fights against Wilder. I bet you he made a couple million dollars in both of those fights alone. And then he's been fighting for so long. I bet you he's made some decent money in his career. Yeah, they're showing the way in. Like, I just don't think Charles Martin is big enough to deal with Luis Ortiz. He's tall like a Lennox Lewis, but he's not built like a Lennox. Like, Lennox was jacked. Like, really jacked. Like, just Sunday morning, 4 a.m. Damn. That's crazy. Oh, so you guys are a day ahead. You guys are in the future, bro. You're in the future. <laughs> Hardcore fight fan. Me too, man. Me too. It's 42-6-4. I wonder what the – they didn't show the weights. Yeah, he's like talking trash to Luis Ortiz, and then he shakes his hand. Oh, 243-246. So Charles Martin weighs three and a half – yeah, weighs three pounds more than him. So they're both coming in around – yeah, they'll probably weigh in tonight a little over 250. Damn, you guys are 4 a.m. in the UK? That's crazy. You guys like Charles? You guys like Charles Martin that much? Is that why you guys are watching? Seastone called me. Let me call him back. Let's see what he's doing. I didn't know. I didn't even know my thing was ringing. I don't play no music. Let's see. I'm on IG. See what he. See if he can see it. I don't. See if he can see it. I got a call on IG from. Sea Stone, the breadwinner, right here out of Houston, Texas. Sea Stone, my guy. I don't know if he's watching. Is he watching? See, you watching? I'm calling you back. See, I'm calling you back. Let me see. I'm live. What's up? Let me see. Oh, he called me a six. 
Oh, I didn't know he called me. My bad. I'm about, I'm live for this Ortiz fight. Okay. Mama, he's coming out. <laughs> Joey, he's coming out. Huh? The main, the main event. Here we go. Let me go. I'm going to go use the bathroom. I'll be right back. Charles Martin is walking out first. Charles Martin is walking out first. All right, I wish I could tell you guys what music he's coming out to, but I can't, because I can't hear it. Okay, guys, tail of the tape. 42-year-old uh, Luis Ortiz versus 35-year-old Charles Martin. Uh, they're both 6'4 six, uh, six versus 6'5. 243 pounds for Lewis, 246 pounds for Charles Martin. Uh, they both got a reach. I forgot what the reach is. I can't see the reach. 32-0 and 0 with two... Oh, only two losses for Luis Ortiz, 27 KOs, 28 and 2, and 25 KOs for Charles Martin. Well, Martin will never have a, a fight this big again. No, probably not. Probably not. He got lucky with his little couple of wins that he got. Here we go. Lewis, Lewis Martin is coming out. I don't know who this little dude is that he has in his corner. Here we go, here we go. I got your chair right here, Mama. Sea <laughs> Stone called me. I don't know. He called me earlier at six. I get I didn't see it ring. He called me on IG. I know. Yeah. Here we go. Charles Martin is coming out. Uh, Luis Ortiz is good. Charles Martin is whack. Trash. Trash. I'll try to sit like this so you can see. All right, here we go. Here we go. Let me try to lock this. There we go. Who's that? That's Charles Martin. That's your birthday twin? No, it's not. The other guy. Come here. Yes. No, you won't. Yeah, you won't. No, heck no. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, me and Luis Ortiz, we got the same birthday. <laughs> March 29th. Shout out to all the March babies. All the Aries. All the Aries. Yeah. We got the same birthday. Oh, 127. That's good. Yeah, yeah, It's been like that all day. You out here. I know. Please don't accept me. Marty the Beast. The chip. What the hell? They be doing some wild stuff. Here we go. Oh, they got the blue lights for Luis Ortiz. They rolling it out for him. Yeah, you sure you want to put that there? Yeah. If you spill it on my... Go. Never be allowed. You like my little way of zooming in? I told you. I did. You like it? Why is heavy rich shaving? Yeah. It kind of feel, it gives it like a depth. See how it pulls away from me? Depth. Oh, you got something in your teeth? It's right there. What is it? Huh? Uh huh. Pepper? Oh, I don't know. It's green, black. Green and black? Mm hmm. That wasn't in there. <laughs> Let me see your phone. I'm trying to think if I got something here. Hmm. 
Damn, what are we spending this $129 at Academy? You, you the main one. At Academy. You, Slingshot? You the main one. Mm hmm. Yeah, let me get this one. What happened to your face? Oh, you got it. What happened to your face? Yeah. All these lines right here. Like oh. you're breaking out. What's no, it's on? the wine. Oh, wine does that to you? When I, when I drink, oh. my face will get red. All right, Luis Ortiz, guys, he's coming out. He's coming out. Ortiz by knockout. I got five, less than five. I go Ortiz in five. Ortiz in oh, five. I recognize him. Yeah, we've seen him fight Deontay Wilder twice. No, this. Oh, him? Yeah. Oh. He, him and I got the same birthday. Watch out because I want you to. I thought he was a coach. Coach? <laughs> he looked like the coach. He looked like the coach. <laughs> he old, too. He got knocked Charles out. I, I'm glad, too. I'm, I think he deserves it, too. He deserves a big knockout win over somebody, uh, former champ in Charles Martin. So, even though Charles should have never been champ, which I don't know. You know, some people just get different different things in life. He is ready. Mm. Luis Ortiz looks serious, guys. He looks ready. Here we go. Main event. Main event. We are here. We are here. Let's turn up. Make sure you guys smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Every time these guys subscribe, they do the little thing. You seen it? They oh, said, it lets you know each this, person? Yeah, yep. This lets me know each person. It actually okay. lets me know any, everybody ever. That's Look. cool. This thing has been recording ever. Oh, from the beginning of time. Oh, yeah, because look at all Ever the... since I signed up, yeah. That's tight. It's weird that it logs all of that. Since you signed up, you signed up a month ago? No. Maybe it deletes it after a while. Oh. Don't forget, guys, send a super chat, guys, to support the channel. You guys can send a super chat to support the channel. Uh, I'm working hard out here. It's the top of the year. King Kong, let's go. King Kong, let's go. You got all wet right there. Mm -hmm. I need a napkin. Mm -hmm. You know I like it wet. <laughs> so, here we go. Keep it PG. That's all I said. I said it wet. I saw myself say I oh. like it. Here oh, we go. That's really good. Yeah, Charles Martin, Southpaw. 6'4, I mean 6'5, 28 wins, two losses. Looks like one draw, 25 knockouts. He's trying to look mad, but it doesn't work. <laughs> I don't know where this. He should just be a nice guy. Your name is Prince Charles. Like, and you wear glasses. Just be a nice guy. You know, you're not a tough guy. You got contacts in right now. Just be, just be a nice guy, okay? You don't have to be. Here we go, King Kong. <laughs> Let's go, King Kong. Cut that young. Look, he got the butterflies. <laughs> Kong got the butterflies. That's dope. That's like a gender reveal. Yeah, he's ready to go. He's gonna knock Charles Martin out. Six four. Thirty two and two. No draws, 27 knockouts, nickname King Kong. Where? Yeah, they, they don't have fighting out of. It should be Cuba. Look at him. Let's go. Out of Cuba. Here we go, guys. I will give you guys a play by play. And the referee for tonight is. Oh, they didn't say his name. Damn, I don't want the water flicking in there. You are Did it flick in there? Ripping. I don't know. But Give me a napkin. Get that napkin. You didn't play me out here. You got Academy receipt. <laughs> You're mad silly. <laughs> there we go. All right, guys. Here we go. And here we go. Charles Martin looks scared. Charles Martin looks scared. Hey, all you Charles Martin people, where y'all at? Bro, stop trying to down the brother, man. Listen, you must be going, son, you must be going for Charles Martin. He about to get knocked out. I want to hear no excuses. He's about to get knocked out. No excuses. He's been doing excuses all night. He'll home. So here we go. Round one. They both come out in their southpaw stance. Nice jab by Luis Ortiz. Another nice jab that catches Martin, moves Martin back. Definitely Charles is definitely pressing the fight. Charles, they're both in the center of the ring. They both haven't thrown anything. All the jabs have been thrown. But okay, Charles Martin with a little jab. But he's like really like off-putting. Like he's like fighting like nervous. Lewis with a nice jab. 
Lewis hasn't thrown. Nobody has thrown a, uh, a left hand yet. They both only have only thrown jabs. But, ooh, nice little jab to the body by Charles Martin. Let's see. Nobody dealt. They're just fainting at each other. They haven't thrown. Little jab by Luis Ortiz. Nice jab by Charles Martin to the body. Another, oh, nice jab that lands for Luis Ortiz. Charles is trying to keep uh, Lewis away with the jab, but uh, Lewis, um, Lewis is, King Kong's jab is just is just is working tonight. He's able to get it on the inside. Up, oh, three jabs from Lewis that keep Charles Martin back. Got a minute fifty three seconds left. I don't know who Lewis is looking really good with these jabs. Charles is trying to throw his jab, but he's not able to keep the pressure from Luis Ortiz off of him. And Luis is moving really good head movement, really good head, head movement. Neither fighter has thrown a left hand yet. They haven't thrown their power hand yet. Oh, there you go. Luis with a, with a power hand. Doesn't really land. Oh, there's a jab. Oh, they called it a trip. Oh, my God. Luis Ortiz with three jabs and Charles falls uh, to the ground, but they said it was a, they said it was a trip. I think he, I think he, I think it was a knockdown, but anyway, so here we go. A minute and 10 seconds left in the first round. They're both boxing. They're both really boxing. They're not really banging like we've seen Luis Ortiz come out and do. Um, I think maybe Luis is just trying to feel him out for this first round. Oh, oh my <laughs> God. Was that a knockdown? No. Charles knocked him down. They're saying it's a knockdown. Was it? Was yeah. that a knockdown? His knees look bad. So Charles Martin knocked down Luis Ortiz. They just did an eight count. Charles Martin knocked him down. Was that a knockdown? I don't know. Are you serious? I got to see the replay. Oh, they both traded left hands, but they both barely missed. They both traded left hands, but they both locked, they both locked arms. Now it's going to be a fight. 22 seconds left in the first round. Charles is landing his jab. And like taking the fight to Lewis. Is he gonna neither fighter has thrown a punch yet, right? Oh, oh, okay. So Charles threw a, a right, right two jabs and a left hand, missed the left hand, and Lewis caught him on Lewis kind of caught him on the inside of that. I can't wait to see the replay to see if that was a real knockdown. Because Ortiz hit him with three jabs, and the referee said it wasn't a knockdown when he fell back. And then they kind of trade punches a little bit, and the referee says it was a knockdown. So here we go. Here we go. Let's see. Boom. Oh, yeah. That was a knockdown. Look at that shot. So Charles knocked him down with a one-two. Boom. He landed a left hand on top of Lewis's head, and it knocked him down. This so fight you, ain't going to last. No, everybody knows this oh, fight's not going to okay. last. Yeah. They are really wow. So Charles is winning. Charles got a 10-8 round. I don't know how. I don't know how, but he's got a knockdown over Luis Ortiz. Wow. In the first round. <laughs> this fight's not – if this fight goes past five, I'll be so surprised. I will be so surprised if this fight goes past tw goes past five. It's empty. Here we go. Oh, yeah, of course it's empty. It's not that mm. – these guys aren't, you know. Boxing fans know who they are. Here we go. Round two, guys. Oh, Lewis takes the fight to him. Lewis, uh, Lewis uh, throws two jabs and a left hand. Charles throws a left hand and misses. Okay, so now Lewis is turning the fight up. Now Lewis is trying to take the fight right to Charles and trying to catch him with shots. Oh, oh, Charles with a big like left hook to the body and then goes over to him with a left with a jab and a right hand. I mean a jab and a left hand. Charles with a nice little jab. Charles is boxing in a circle. Doing pretty good. He, he missed those two jabs right there, but he landed that nice left hand to the body of uh, of of Luis Ortiz. Now a nice little jab by um, by Ortiz. Now they're not really punching again. They're going back to like feeling each other out more like chest. Ooh, big right hook by. Ooh, big right hook and some jabs, but they all miss for Martin. Oh, big combination return for Ortiz. So, Lewis, I mean, so Charles Martin threw a jab, but then Ortiz followed with a with a few, like, hard punches and a combination. 
So this is really anybody's fight, but Charles Martin is winning the fight so far based off of the first round and his knockdown. So Ortiz is fighting a smarter fight. I think he has a little bit of respect for Martin's power. The fact that he was able to knock him down, but it was more like of a flash knockdown because he got right up. Now Ortiz is taking the fight to Martin. Martin is just doing like slick boxing, trying to jab him. Hasn't really landed anything significant. Oh, big left hand by Martin and a counter uh, and a counter left hand by Ortiz. That pushed Martin back uh, about a minute and six seconds left in the second round. Now Ortiz is kind of ramping it up just a little bit. Oh, nice big one, one, two by Ortiz. and like nods his head, catches Martin, catches Martin going back. There we go. That's the Ortiz that we know. Coming in with the jab, really controlling the fight, taking the fight to Martin. Martin hasn't really thrown anything. Martin just, Charles is just kind of backing up, just trying to paw him with the jab and stuff like that, but he's not really landing anything. It's, it's, it's Ortiz who's really taking the fight to Charles. But again, because of the knockdown in the first round, even if Charles loses this, ooh, I think something's wrong with, something's wrong with Ortiz's leg. Like his, his legs keep falling from underneath him. It's weird. It's almost like he hurt his knee. They keep, his legs keep going out from underneath him. A couple of shots have landed from Martin, a couple of jabs. But he hasn't landed anything major like he did in the first round. Ooh, big left hand by Ortiz. Nice little jab by uh, by Martin. Jab to the body by Charles Martin. And again, now they're just boxing. End of the second round. Again, so even if you give that round to Ortiz, the fight is tied 1-1. Uh, because it was a 10-8 round for Charles. So techno, yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. I guess Witchcraft's family is crying. Oh, yeah, I guess that's his family. Who's? Ortiz, because they had the King Kong shirts. Look at all these moves. Look at all these shots. Ooh. Missing. Boom, boom. Big left hand. So they're showing the replay. They're showing the shots at either fight or land at each other, but uh, really good defense by Ortiz. They got the vinyl, babe. They got the gold vinyl. <laughs> You're doing a great job commentating the fight, bro. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. I knew I should have paid that 40 to see the fight. It's a good fight. I'm not going to lie. It's a good He said, I knew I should, yeah, it's only 40 bucks, man. Go ahead. It's worth it. Or you can hang out with me. You can pay the 40 here. I'll take it. You can pay the 40. Oh. Right there, guys. Super chat, super chat, super chat, super chat. <laughs> round three, round three, round three. Let's go. Make sure you guys hit that like button. We only have 87 likes. Let's get to 100 likes, guys. 100 likes. Let's get to 100 likes. Got 145 people watching. Third, third round. Ooh, big one, one, two by Ortiz. So two jabs and a left hand by Ortiz. Two minutes and 51 seconds left in the third round. Now Ortiz is taking a fight to Charles Martin. Remember, Charles Martin got a knockdown in the first round. So that was a 10-8 round. So now the fight, technically, I give the second round to Ortiz. Now we're in the third round. So if Ortiz can win this, he can make the fight even. Ooh, Charles tries to land the left hook. And then Ortiz lands a left, uh, like a left jab to the body. Nice little left hand by, by Charles Martin, which kind of has Ortiz going back. Nice little jab to the body by Charles Martin. Nice little jab up top. So Charles Martin is really trying to control right now. This round, he's trying to control Ortiz with the jab. Nice little left hand, but he missed. Nice jab that sort of lands on the gloves of Ortiz. But now Ortiz is kind of coming in with his hands up, taking the fight to Charles. So Ortiz hasn't thrown a punch yet, but he's coming in with his hands up high, trying to time. What is that? Oh, we got a subscriber, Jonathan. Yay. We got a subscriber, we got a subscriber, we got a subscriber, we got a subscriber. Guys, thank you, appreciate it. <laughs> ding, ding, ding. Oh, big left hand by uh, Martin that catches Martin, uh, catches Ortiz on top. They kind of go, uh, they kind of come in close. Ortiz runs a couple, like two shots off. But Ortiz now is he's not, Ortiz is now looking to fight and time Martin as he did right there. He threw a jab, Martin threw a jab back, and then Ortiz hit him with a left hand up top. Wasn't hard. Ooh, nice little nice little jab left hand by Martin. He tried. Uh, two big shots that totally missed by Ortiz. Let's see that now again they're just looking at each other. Ortiz is just looking at him. Ortiz is just like just staying there. Nice little jab by Martin. Not, nothing too hard by Martin. Nothing too hard. Just nice jab to the stomach by Martin. Nothing too hard. Nothing too crazy. Oh, Martin just tried to throw a big left hand. Missed. 
that one probably would have dropped Ortiz. But Ortiz doesn't really throw none. Ortiz activity is kind of really dropped. Almost as if like he's tired or he's, if he's out of shape. Oh, they both, and once again, both threw big left hands but missed and got their arms caught. So they're, they're basically, it's like Ortiz is saving his energy for one big power shot to catch Martin. And obviously they're throwing them at the same time. So they're both trying to knock each other out. They're like boxing and then they're both trying. Oh, we got another subscriber. Kuki Kai, Kuki Kai, got another subscriber. Kuki Kai, Kuki Kai. Is their name up there? Yeah, right there. Oh, no. Right yeah, up there. there. Yeah, That's yeah, yeah. Cool. Got another subscriber, guys. Thank you for subscribing. Smash that like button. Oh, we got another subscriber. <laughs> Is that a subscriber? Sean? Sean Gang. Sean Gang, Sean Gang. We got another subscriber, another subscriber. Thank you guys for subscribing. Oh, yes. Sabbath King. Oh, yeah, there it is. Yeah, Kang, Kang, Kang. That's cool. Kang, Kang, Kang. It's another subscriber, guys. Every time you guys subscribe, you get a little notification right there. Also, guys, we got um, 91 likes, guys. We're at eight. No, nine likes away from 100. Nine likes away from 100, guys. Smash that like button. Smash that like button. If you guys like what I'm doing, we're going into the fourth round. Subscriber, subscriber, subscriber. Debo, Debo Cruz, Debo Cruz, Debo Cruz, Debo Cruz. Let me look like this, like That's this, cool. like this, like this, like this. Mm -hmm. Very interesting. Mm -hmm. Oh, Martin will beat Cruz in six. I don't know, man. I mean, will beat Ortiz in six. I don't know. He could. It's a very even fight so far. I give the last two rounds to Ortiz. Oh, they're showing. Oh, that's Charles' family. So they're showing Charles' family. They already showed Ar Ortiz' family. Other little baby. So here we go, guys. 160 people viewing. Let's go. Got 94 likes. Hit that like button, guys. Smash that subscribe button, guys. We're in the fourth round. I didn't even think it was going to go this long. Well, no, I think it's going to go to five. So we're in the fourth round right now. Charles Martin knocked him down in the first round. Ooh, Ortiz is coming out hard with a big body shot to the big straight body shot after nice jabs. I know, right? So, oh, big left, ooh, ooh, jab left hand by Charles Martin. Charles Martin is turning it up. He's got, he's got Ortiz on the ropes. Ortiz had to hold the ropes for a second. Remember, Charles Martin has a knockdown in the first round. So, he does have some power enough to, to knock or Ortiz down. Don't forget, guys, smash. Oh, big jab, jab, left hand that landed for Charles Martin and, and cracked Ortiz. Now, Ortiz with a big left hand. It catches uh, Martin on top of the head. Doesn't really hurt him. Two minutes and 24 seconds left in the fourth round, guys. Is this fight going to go to round six or round five? Let me know if this guy, if this fight's going to go to round five. Let me know. Let me know if this guy, if this fight's going to go to round five. I don't think so, but we're going to see. So, nice jab and then a big left hand miss by Charles Martin. And then a nice little jab back by, by Ortiz. Again, I have Ortiz winning rounds two and three. And now we're in round four. Obviously, the round one goes to Charles Martin because he knocked him down. Big left hand that, that, that Martin goes for. Miss, just barely misses Charles. I mean, just barely misses Martin. I mean, just barely misses Ortiz. Good <laughs> Lord. I'm bugging right now. Let's go, let's go, let's go. 145 people in here. 96 likes, guys. Let's get to 100 likes. Four more likes, guys. Four more likes. Smash that subscribe button, guys. I'm going crazy. Round four, minute 37 seconds left. These guys are actually turning up the fight, turning it up. Now Now Ortiz is kind of taking the fight to him, throwing some jabs. Oh, we got another subscriber, another subscriber. She, 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 Delanda, she, Delanda, she. Subscriber, you guys get to see your subscribers, man. Look at that. So, oh, oh, big one, big, big jab, left hand. Shout out to another subscriber. Is that Diggs? She, hold on, who's the other? I can't see that. Is that Joseph? Joseph, 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 Joseph. Thank oh. you for your subscribing, bro. So now they're landing big shots, guys, big shots. Oh, we got another subscriber. We got another subscriber. Who is that? I can't see. Is that Ty111? Got another subscriber, guy. Keep subscribing, guys. Keep subscribing, guys. I got to give the action. I got to give the action. Keep subscribing. Keep subscribing to see your name up there. 52 seconds left, guys. They've landed some pretty hard shots in this round. This round is really even, so it's really going to come down to these last couple of seconds to see who's going to win these rounds. We got another subscriber, Eric, Eric Vega, Eric Vega. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So big right hand. Ooh, big left hand by Ortiz. Oh, you saw that, right? Oh, come on, come on, come on. 33 seconds left in the fourth round, guys. Ortiz is really picking it up. Ortiz is like, it's like he's this close to knocking Charles Martin out. And that close to falling. And that close to falling. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely. You could talk to him if you want to say anything. They seem very like. I know, right? Mm -hmm. I wonder if she would, I wish I could have this little bigger so I can see the, see the people. But it says it right there. Oh, is oh, that a knockdown? 
I missed it again. Charles Martin knocks him down oh again. Oh, my God. Charles Martin knocks Luis Ortiz down again. Oh, my God. And, and <laughs> Ortiz is just having his head nod like this. We missed it. Oh, my God, guys. Oh smash that like button. Smash that subscribe button, guys. Y'all, I am totally... Okay, here it is. Here it is. So, here we go. Charles Martin. Oh, Charles Martin knocks him down with a jab. I think Ortiz is just too old. Charles Martin knocks him down with a jab. Boom. Oh, all he did was this. On, just dude. a straight boom. Just Ugh. boom. That's it. That's all Charles Martin did. They're showing it from the top view. Boom. Ooh. That's it. Ooh. Look at his legs. Yeah, yeah, I think Ortiz is too old. I think Ortiz is too old. He got knocked down with a jab, guys. This is his second knockdown already. So even if he was winning, he just got the rounds that he won erased because Charles keeps knocking him down. Oh, Mr. Mr. Hafonix has, has just subscribed. Thank you, Mr. Hafonix. Thank, hi, Phonics. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for subscribing, guys. Smash that like button. We had 104 likes, 164 people watching, guys. Charles Martin, to me, is winning the fight. He was losing up until that fourth round knockdown. He has two knockdowns in four rounds, guys. He's winning the fight. Charles Martin <laughs> is winning the fight. And I think Ortiz is just too old. 42 years old. He's just to a 35-year-old. Charles Martin, I don't know. He's losing. Ortiz is losing the fight. I'm still going for Ortiz. He's my guy. But Charles Martin just keeps knocking him down. How many times are you going to get knocked down? Oh, there we go. Another subscriber, another subscriber. Wesley, Wesley, Wesley. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Thank you for the subscribe. Let's go, guys. Two minutes and 31 seconds left. Again, Charles is just boxing really well. And he, he keeps catching Ortiz with shots that drop him. He just missed with a big left uppercut. That almost would have dropped him. That definitely would have dropped him because every if a jab can drop Ortiz right now, then I think an uppercut would. Nice little left hand by by Ortiz. Unfortunately, what I'm noticing that Charles Martin has been able to take Ortiz's shots as he tees off on on Ortiz. But Ortiz has really slick defense. But it's like something's wrong with Ortiz's legs or something. He's not really throwing with power like we're used to seeing him do, especially against like a big guy like Wilder. Like we've seen him get Wilder problems. But he's not doing that with Charles Martin. And really, oh, yeah, you saw that elbow? He almost fell again. I know. Something's, it's like something he has like a knee problem. Like when he fell in the first round, mm -hmm. like he hurt his leg. And he's like like barely fighting on his front leg. I don't know. But it's definitely Charles Martin that's winning this fight. Um, I think Charles is one shot away from knocking Ortiz out or down. And we know that Ortiz can be knocked smooth out. And I think a lot... Charles Martin is really impressing me. I did not think he could fight like this. Maybe his awkward style is just what turned me off to him, but I'm really impressed. A couple big shots by Ortiz. A big left hand up top that didn't really land, but a nice little body shot down below. Another subscriber, another subscriber, another subscriber. Wagner, thank you, thank you, thank you. With the smiley face. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You guys are going to send some Super Chats next? Guys, gonna send some super chats next. Super chats next. Super chats next. Go ahead, send your super chats, guys. Fifty-four seconds left in the fifth round, guys. Let me know if you guys are feeling this. I got one hundred and seventy people in here. Smash that like button. Smash that like button. Oh, they both just straight big left hands miss. Big right hand to the body by Luis Ortiz. Again, if you're just now joining the broadcast, Charles Martin is winning. He has knocked. Uh, Ortiz down twice in the first round and the fourth round. He's winning this fight with just slick boxing, and he's able to catch Ortiz. Again, I think it's really Ortiz is really old. Some, it looks like something's wrong with Ortiz's legs, but Charles Martin is doing really well. Charles Martin has not looked like that he's been hurt by any shots as uh, Ortiz just landed in a nice left hand right there to, to Charles Martin's face, but outside of that, it does see? Nice little jab that they traded, but Charles Martin is, seems like he's a little heavy, little heavy-handed uh, in this fight compared to Ortiz as he steps it up and stands right in front of Ortiz with the right hands. Ooh, throws a, a right hand, left hand up top. Doesn't the, the left hand didn't hit Ortiz. Ooh, Ortiz comes back to end the fifth round with a nice right hand. Oh, a nice left hand. Don't underestimate Ortiz. I'm not under, Oh, yeah, I underestimated Martin's punch of power. I did, bro. I totally did. I totally did. I didn't think he could hit like this. I didn't think he could. No, it's not excuses. <laughs> He is, hey, listen, he's earning it. I'm thinking Ortiz is going to win. Hey, he's earning it. One Martin is earning shot. it. One good shot with Ortiz, and he can take them down. A hundred percent, yeah. Good One shot. good shot with either fighter, and they could take yeah. each other down. It's it's really looking like that. Yeah. But, you know, you know what I mean? Because he's still a wounded dog, but, you know, he could still throw a shot and clip Martin. Let me know, guys. Hit that. 
Super chat if you guys are liking what's going on. Smash that super chat. You know what I mean? Send something. We got 172 people in all 106 likes, guys. Smash that like button, guys, and hit that subscribe button. But definitely hit that like button. Let's run up these likes, guys. Let's run up these views. Let's run up these likes. Charles Martin, to me, is winning the fight, even though I give the fifth round. So I give three to Ortiz and five to Ortiz. One, four, uh, and now we're in six. So one and four go to... Martin with the knockdowns. So he has two knockdowns of both of the rounds that he won. I'll give, um, who do I give round two to? I give round two to, to Ortiz. So I got round two. Oh, big left hand! The car! The car! It's car, man! It's car, man! It's car, man! He's knocking Martin out! Ortiz is knocking Martin out! Ortiz is knocking Martin out! He knocked Martin smooth out! He knocked Martin smooth out! He knocked Martin out! He knocked Martin out! Oh, his arm is stuck! Oh, his arm is stuck! Oh, his arm is stuck! Oh, snap! Oh snap! Oh snap! I've never seen that before. I've never seen that before. Oh, that's bull! Oh snap! That's not fair. So Martin's whole arm got stuck in the ropes. What? They keep going? Yeah, they're gonna let it keep happening. Give him a second. Wow, that's crazy. He's on wobbly legs though. So Ortiz is smashing on Martin right now. What? Now they're just going blow for blow. Oh, big left hand by, by oh. Ortiz. That catches Martin. But he's not going down yet. Big left. Oh, now here comes Ortiz coming back. Now Ortiz is just digging to the body. Oh, trying to get or, trying to get uh, 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 Martin out of it. But Martin won't go down. Martin won't go down. Oh, big right hand by Ortiz. M Ortiz is trying to knock him out. Is he going down? Oh. And he finally goes down. Oh, my God. A minute 34 left in the six round. Guys, smash that. Smash that, uh, Super Jacks, and a Super Jacks, and a Super Jacks. Yeah. They're laying out the fire, Ortiz won! They're laying out the fire, Ortiz won! Ah, I told you! Ortiz won! Ortiz won! Knocked him out! Knocked him out! Knocked him out! I told you! Knocked him out! I tried to tell you, don't Knock them out! Don't underestimate him! Don't underestimate him! Let's go! Let's go. It's the King Kong. I told you. Smash that subscribe button. Smash that like button. Ortiz, okay, stop okay, it. Here goes, here goes. Boom. Okay. Big left hand. That head. He's, he's, he's not even looking. That's what yeah, he's, he's out on his feet. Why do they keep letting him hit him? Because you have to. You have to protect yeah, yourself. Okay, from so and then this right here is where his arm gets stuck. Because he got knocked smooth out and then his arm got yeah, stuck. Yeah, and then. I he got knocked so smooth out, his arm got stuck in the ropes. Look at that. Look. Boom. Boom. He was going to keep getting hurt. Because he ain't got no chin. I can't believe they let him. Hell yeah. Him. It's protect yourself at all times. Hell yeah. After, look, it don't matter. It don't matter. Him. It don't matter. He's well, they did stop it. The ref, when he seen him the second time, was like, He's I'm going to stop it. You're going to keep getting hurt. Out of there. He don't know what's Smash going. that like button, guys. Luis Ortiz knocked him smooth out. Wow. That, that's, that feels kind of dirty. I don't like that. It's boxing. I don't like that. Now, look, look, look. He's not even, look. He's not paying him no attention. Look. Look, he's looking at him like, yeah, no, it's done. Wow, poor thing. It's done. I'm good, I'm good. Martin keeps saying, I'm good. No, you're not, bro. No, you're not. <laughs> you're not good, no. Let's go, let's go, let's do it. You're not good, bro. You're not good. Luis Ortiz was finna break you like... Y'all try to play Luis. I, I try to play him. Yeah, he too... Oh, his knees. I, I told you, one good shot, he's out of there. <sighs> He is old. Got, he, he is he is old. <laughs> oh man, that was a good fight, guys. But we knew it wasn't. What I said? What round was that? Six? Yeah, there we go. See, I knew it. I knew it. I said five. I called five and went to six. Okay, cool. We knew there was gonna be a knockout. That's why they put this fight together. They knew what they was doing. They knew who was gonna knock out. They knew. Yeah, this fight was gonna end in a knockout. Debo said I called it in six. Bad, bad, bad. Debo called it, man. Debo called it. <clears throat> Hell of a fight, guys. Hell of a fight. Oh, hell of a fight, man. Listen. Oh. Old boy was... He knocked down Ortiz in the first and in the fourth. Oh, that's probably his grandkids, huh? Oh, it could be his daughter. He's only 42. Oh. You said grandkids. You trying to play him? No, I thought he You trying to play him? He's only 42. Like little kids. He, those can't be his kids. Why not? Latinos, y'all be popping out kids late. Never heard of yeah. I mean, so do black people. I was going to say, your daddy's a man. I know. <laughs> <laughs> get hurt, he, oh, 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 what's Charles going to say? Charles going to give him credit or what? I don't like it. It was dirty. How is it? It's boxing. Mm -hmm. So they're saying, oh, so Charles is saying, good fight to everybody, good fight. He's late. Huh? 
He sleep. Yeah, I know. He got hit and said, he got hit and said. He was like in shock. Yeah, I've his, never yeah. seen that. Yeah. But that's what I'm saying. If your body's in shock, why they let you keep hitting them? Hell yeah. If you're like this, like, oh. Because you don't even know if the person's playing. You don't know if they're being serious. What's funny to me is he got hit and started talking to somebody over here. His mouth is moving. I said, what is going on? I've never seen nothing like that. I've never seen nobody's arm ever get caught like that. He said, Martin rematch. You're bugging. Martin put up a good fight. He got he got my props. How you so you like losers? That's cool. I understand you like losers. I understand that makes sense. That's cool. Mm, she's That's crazy. Crying. Smash! I like my That's guys. Gotta, they all got the same eyes. Yeah, they all do. I was thinking the same thing. You're hundred percent right. That's <laughs> funny. They do. They all got the same eyes, so they're definitely his. <laughs> they're not his grandkids. He's only forty two. Right. Didn't he have a translator? Yeah, he got a translator. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wish we could hear this. This is funny. Ortiz barely got it. That's what's funny, player. <laughs> I know. Hey, you got to get it how you live. <laughs> you got to get it how you live, even if it's barely. He got the W. That's all that matters. He's retiring after this? I don't know. He is old, though. He didn't look good. Mm -mm. But, I mean, think about it. He knocked out a 35-year-old guy. He's 42. You know what I mean? For him to still be able to compete at this level, give him his props. He's an old man in the game. But he still got power. You know what I mean? The dude still got power. And he only ever lost to Deontay Wilder. They both were doing like wild mm -hmm. shots. They weren't like, they were just, yeah. weren't even moving. Both of them. Mm -hmm. Just like Yeah. That's weird that they all got the same eyes. That's funny. <laughs> he's the <laughs> That's his family. I bet they cry too. <laughs> oh my god, that was so funny. That's not very It was hilarious. He got cracked. They are that's weird. I've never seen all three people with the same exact eyes. Usually kids get like different you know what I mean? But they all have it. Mm -hmm. They don't even look like him, though. That's what I'm saying. They don't look like him. They all mm. look like each other, but they don't look like him. I know he has a daughter with some type of disease. Oh. That, was, that might one of them might be her. He got blasted, though. <laughs> Charles Martin got blasted. King Kong boxing. Baby. King Kong boxing. He was old. He is old. He still won. Your guy lost. Sorry, fire. Sorry, fire. Is that Jesus? Jesus, subscribe. They probably made like <clears throat> 12,000 from this fight. Y'all got to hit this. Y'all got to hit that, man. We worked hard tonight. No, nah, they made more than 12 grand. <laughs> you playing them. They made some good money. You think? Yeah, yeah. PBC, PBC, they make good money. It's a pay-per-view. Mm. So even without the, you know, they're going to make some money. A little $40 or $39.99, you know. People got $40 beginning of the year. <clears throat> All right, we're going to turn the music back up. Turn the music back up for the party. Oh, yeah. Turn the music back up for the party. Yeah, he got the Versace. Hey, yeah, they got no money. Remember, he got them two big fights with uh, mm. with Wilder. So you know he made some money. You know he made a couple dollars. I don't remember that Wilder. I remember him. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, remember he got knocked smooth out. <laughs> he did. Yeah, he died. I thought he died. I be thinking everybody died. Yeah, though. he did. That's good. I wish we could hear it, but I can, I can watch it after. Hear what he, you know, I'm going to hear what he has to say. Let me mute my mic.
Got to turn it off. Got to turn my mic up, man. All right, yeah, Um, the next boxing event, uh, Jude, I, whenever the next boxing event is, is, oh, he punched a referee? <laughs> what? He saw, he looked at him. Yeah. Yeah, he punched the referee. Yeah, whatever the next big boxing event is, whoever's next, man, I'll be covering it. Especially if it's PBC. I try to cover as much PBC content as possible. I'm surprised they weren't in the room tonight, but they know I cover all their events. So I try to cover. So, yeah, whenever the next big boxing or UFC fight is, I will definitely be covering, guys. Thank you guys for tuning in. And uh, please stay tuned. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel for all other content related to all the things that we do here. I got my wife to my right. We're about to go and enjoy the rest of the Saturday night. But... You guys have any questions or want to talk boxing? I'll be doing a lot more lives outside just to cover sports. Uh, maybe doing like stuff leading up to major events. I don't know. We're going to be doing a lot of stuff for 2022. Uh, who won? Uh, Ortiz knocked. Ortiz stopped uh, Martin in the sixth round TKO stoppage. It was a really good fight. Uh, Martin dropped him twice. Look at that. Look, look, look. And he, look, he's going to start talking. Look at him. Look at him. <laughs> It's protect yourself at all times. That's the rule. But he don't know. That he knows. He's in the ring. You gotta protect yourself at all times. You gotta protect yourself at all times. Lewis Ortiz won by knockout. Lewis Ortiz won by knockout, guys. By knockout. By knockout. By knockout. Lewis Ortiz won. Pay per view is over, guys. We are going to watch Matrix Four. <laughs> We're gonna watch. You tired? You know I gotta wind down. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you guys for tuning in, and uh, stay tuned for the next one. And subscribe to the channel for more content. Uh, we got all types of content.